So much to learn about. It'll make you wanna shout, Mika! Hey, it's me, Mika! And today I'm at Munchkin's Indoor Playground in Los Angeles, California. This place is so awesome because you get to move your body and have a lot of fun. And we get to play a game today. Come on! Meet you at the bottom. Whoa! <laughs> that was so fast. Did you see? Oh, and I landed in a ball pit. Whoa! Ball pits are so fun. Ooh, and I like all of these colors. Let's see. <gasps> Pink. <laughs> and there's blue. And white. There's so much you can do in a ball pit. You can dance. You could juggle. Whoa, I only know how to juggle two balls. I don't know how to do three yet. I have to keep practicing. <laughs> hey, look over here. Whoa, at the very top, it looks like a big scoop of ice cream or maybe a marshmallow or something. Oh, and there's a cool looking pattern on it. White. Blue, white, blue, white, blue, white, blue, all the way around. Aw, oh, I like that. Ooh, let's go inside. Ooh. Hello. <laughs> oh, this is a fun little space. Hmm. Whoa, look at this. This ball has words on it. Oh, let's read it. Go to the slide for an item to catch and find the play area that looks like it's match. A match, that means that it looks the same. Hmm, hey, looks like we get to exercise our bodies and our minds. <laughs> this is gonna be a really good game for the mind. Hmm, go to the slide. There must be another slide here. Let's go find it. Oh! to be the other slide. I wonder what's gonna happen here that will help me play the game. <gasps> Look! Whoa! Have you seen this before? It's a stethoscope. Maybe you've seen one at the doctor's office? Yeah, a doctor will use this to listen to your heartbeat. Oh yeah, nice and healthy. <laughs> I wonder if there's a doctor center around here. Let's go find out. Hmm. I wonder where this stethoscope goes. Oh, look at this cool thing. Ooh. Hello. Oh, let's look up here. Hmm, I don't think this is where our stethoscope belongs. <laughs> it's really fun though. Whoa, hmm. <gasps> hey look, mini clinic. We found it. This is a doctor's office. The stethoscope definitely belongs there. Come on. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, hello, welcome. Do you have an appointment? You're, oh, yep, you're right there. Come on in. <laughs> Doctors and nurses are so cool and very important. They take care of us and make sure we're feeling nice and healthy. They check your heartbeat. See what kind of tools are in here. Ooh. They'll probably look at your eyes and look inside your ears. <laughs> and sometimes they have you stick your tongue out and say, ah. Ooh, and look, there's some glasses. Ooh, one of my favorite colors too, yellow. And look, you can dress up like a doctor. So official. And a little hat. Oh, how do I look? Dr. Mika. <laughs> Okay, so this is definitely where the stethoscope goes. Okay, let's just clean up and go back to the slide. Come on. I'm so excited to see what the next item is. Here it comes. Whoa. <gasps> Do you know what this is? It's a tomato. Ooh, one of my favorites. Yum. <laughs> hmm, I wonder if there's a grocery store or something here. Let's go look. Whoa, a carousel. Ooh, 
Ooh, look at this nice orange one. Let's get on. Oh, hello, horsey. I'm Mika. Hmm, I wonder how this thing works. That's not it. Oh, that's it. <laughs> Ooh, this is fun. Hey, what a cool way to look for a space where the tomato belongs. Hmm, let me know if you see something. <gasps> right there. A supermarket. This is definitely where the tomato belongs. Hey, look down here. More food. Yeah, a supermarket or a grocery store is where you can buy food, like a tomato. Hmm. What are some other red foods? <gasps> Ooh, what about this red pepper? Yummy. Hmm. Oh, here's another red pepper. And, oh, I love this red food. Strawberries. <laughs> I'm gonna have a red meal. Hmm. Ooh, more strawberries. And, Okay, now I have all of my food. I have to pay for it. Let's go inside. <laughs> Come on. Do, 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 do. Okay. Oh. All right, let's see. Oh, I guess I can ring up my own items. Hmm. All right, bell pepper. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, interesting. <laughs> Strawberries. Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> okay. More strawberries? Beep, beep, beep. Oh, now we're cooking. Pepper. Beep, beep, beep. Ooh. Apple. Beep, beep, beep. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And tomato. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, yeah. Now we're grooving. How am I going to pay for this food? I don't know, but I'm in a good mood. <laughs> oh, it looks like I have a credit card here. Let's see. My grand total is... <laughs> Okay, let's see. Okay, that worked. All right, don't need any change. I think I'm done here. <laughs> okay, so the tomato is with the food. Good job matching with me. Hey, let's go back to the slide and see what else comes down. Come on. I'm having so much fun. I wonder what the next item will be. Whoa, look at this. A firefighter helmet. Yeah, firefighters will wear a helmet like this to protect their heads when they're fighting fires. Huh, I wonder what kind of area would have a firefighter helmet. <laughs> Let's go find out. Whoa, did you find where the firefighter helmet belongs? <laughs> Good job, looks like a match. See, there's a fire truck and firefighters drive fire trucks to where the fire is to put it out and save the day. <laughs> this is a really cool truck. Oh, see the big ladder and, ooh, a walkie talkie. <laughs> Firefighter Mika here, over. <laughs> yes, that is correct, everything is fine here. Yes, have a good day. <laughs> okay, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, and look, Here's where the siren is, so people know that a fire truck is on the way. It sounds like something like that. <laughs> okay, let's see. I'll put this firefighter helmet here. That way, if someone wants to play, they can be the driver and wear the firefighter helmet and look like a real firefighter. <laughs> let's go back to the slide and see what the next item is. Come on. Yes, so far so good. And I think there's another item about to come down. Whoa, oh, that was fast. Ooh, what is this, Gouda? <laughs> That's kind of cheese, one of my favorites. <laughs> oh, do you know what letter that is? It's the first letter of the alphabet. <laughs> That's right, the letter A. Hmm, I wonder if there are more letters around here. Let's go look. Okay, I have the letter A. I wonder if there are any other letters around. Hmm. Oh, I see letters in there. Let's go inside. Oh, whoa, it's a trampoline. <laughs> All right, let's see. I have the letter A, 
and there's B, C, D. This is definitely where the letter A goes. Hey, I know what we could do. We could think of an animal that begins with the letter A, and then we could act it out. <laughs> hmm. <gasps> I have one. Ant eater. <laughs> Can you act like an ant eater? They do, in fact, eat ants. They have really long nose and mouth, and they go around and they look for ants. Any ants over here? Nom, 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 nom. Any ants over here? Nom, 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 nom. Hey, give me that ant back. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> And the next letter, the letter B. Ooh, I know one, a bat. Let's act like bats together. Bats begin with the letter B. Spread your wings and fly like a bat. Or jump, whoa. Kind of feels like I'm flying for real. <laughs> and the letter C. Cat begins with the letter C. Hmm, how can we act like cat? Get your little paws out and meow, 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 meow. Whoa, calm down, cat, calm down, cat. What about the letter D? The animal starts with the letter D. <gasps> dog! Can you act like a dog with me? Okay. and see if there are any more items. Come on. Oh, these slides are so cool. I wonder if anything else will slide down. Oh, look, it's one of the ball pit balls. I wonder if we need to go to the other ball pit. Whoa. Oh yeah, we definitely need to go to the other ball pit. Let's go. Okay, let's go find that ball pit. Come on. Whoa, a big white slide. Oh, I have to go down. Ready? Three, two, one. Woo! Whoa, that was so fast. Do you see the ball pit? It's behind me. Whoa, let's find a fun way to get into it. Hello. Whoa, look at this. It's a big slide. All right, I'm going down. See you at the bottom. Whoa. <laughs> I love that there are two ball pits in this indoor playground. Whoa. Oh, we just swim on over. <laughs> Whoa, this is so fun. This is definitely where the white ball belongs. There you go. <laughs> hey, look at this wall. See the two colors, pink and blue? And it makes a pattern, see? Pink, blue, pink, blue. Do you know what the next color is? <laughs> That's right, pink. Hey, look at that little car. It's so cute. And there's three more ball pit balls. There's a pink one, and a white one, and a blue one. And there's words on this one. Let's see. You've finished the game, now count all you've done, then go down the slide for some extra fun. Whoa, that means we finished the game. We did it, we did it, we really, really did it. Oh, awesome. Okay, it says count all you've done. Do you remember the items that we found? Okay, we found the stethoscope, the tomato, the firefighter helmet, the letter A, and a ball pit ball. Will you count the items with me? <laughs> Great. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. And then it says, Go down the slide for some extra fun. Well, let's go down the slide. Come on. Yes, now it's my turn to go down the slide. 
Will you count down with me? Okay, three, two, one. Woo! Whoa! <laughs> wow, that was so much fun. Hey, we figured everything out. We did it. We did it. We did it. Oh, yeah, we did it. Let's go. High five. <laughs> nice job. Thank you so much for helping me with that matching game. We exercised our minds by figuring out which play center matches which item, and we exercise our bodies by running around this indoor playground. <laughs> that was a lot of fun, and thank you for learning with me. Well, that's the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye. Hi, it's me, Mika. And today we are at Southern Hill Farms in Claremont, Florida. This farm is so cool because they grow flowers and they grow fruit. So today I want to pick some blueberries, make blueberry lemonade, and find some beautiful sunflowers. I love sunflowers because they're yellow. One of my favorite colors. Come with me. that you can use to collect the blueberries in once they're picked. <laughs> That's so fun. Oh, come down here, look at this. <laughs> Have you ever seen sand on a farm before? <laughs> yeah, you might not expect sand at a farm, but this sand that's really soft and fine, it's called sugar sand, and it's really helpful for the blueberries. With this sand, the water can drain quickly, which is super important because blueberries do not grow in a lot of water. So this sand's really fun to play with and touch, but it's really important for the blueberries. So I'll just leave that there. <laughs> do you want to pick blueberries with me? Let's go. Take a look at this. It's a blueberry bush or a shrub. Here, come a little closer. See, there's, oops. <laughs> A stem and the leaves and look, the fruit, the best part. <laughs> so see how some of these berries, they're different colors. There's kind of a purple, a blue and a green. Do you know which berry is ripe? <laughs> That's right, this one, the blue one. Those are the ones that you wanna pick. And ripe means that it's fully grown and ready to eat. <laughs> They're so cute. I know, we could pick 20 ripe blueberries. Will you count with me? Cool. So we have one. Hmm. Oh, here's another one. Two. Oop, there's one down here. Three, four, Almost there. 17. 18. 19. 20. 20 ripe blueberries. Thanks for counting with me. See, you can pick them off of the bush or you can pick them up off the ground as long as they're nice, blue, and ripe. <laughs> oh. This is gonna be really good in my blueberry lemonade. You can do all sorts of things with blueberries. What do you like to do with blueberries? You could make jam or jelly for a blueberry and peanut butter sandwich, or you can make a smoothie, blueberry pancakes, cupcakes, parfaits, juice. 
There's so much you can do with blueberries. <sighs> Should we keep looking at blueberries? All right, cool. Let's go over there. There's more. <gasps> wow, look! It's a baby blueberry shrub. See, it's much smaller than the other plants we saw. But one day, it's gonna grow nice and big and full and have a ton of blueberries on it. You'll notice on the young plants, they have little flowers, see? <laughs> so cute. Oh, I see another ripe blueberry. Here, take a look. See how it kind of looks white on the outside? That's called bloom. And bloom is like a sunblock for blueberries. It protects it against the sun so the blueberries don't get too much sun. Check it out, a really big yellow slide. Oh, I have to go down. Let me put my blueberries down so I don't spill any and I'm nice and safe. Come on. Whoa, I get it. You use the potato sack to go down the slide. See, you put your feet in here in the bottom, get situated and then you woo, woo, woo. <laughs> Oh, look at this. You must be this tall to ride alone. All others must ride with an adult. All right, let's see. Oh, I think I'm tall enough to ride alone. <laughs> let's check it out. Okay. Whoa, it's really high up. This is quite the climb. This slide is gonna be awesome! Look how high we are! You can see the entire farm! <laughs> okay, only slide feet first. Okay, that was my plan anyway. All right, so you lay your potato sack down like this. You sit down and feet first. Feet will go in this little pocket here. <gasps> okay. You wanna watch me slide all the way down to the bottom? All right, see you there. <laughs> Three, two, one, slide! Woo! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> that was so fast. That was awesome. <laughs> all right, let's put this over here. And my blueberries! Oh, there they are. All right, come on, blueberries. And you come too, there's more fun things to do. Oh, check it out, it's a carousel. Have you ever been on a carousel before? <laughs> well, let's go. Blueberries down and go for a ride. Hmm. Oh, I love this horse. Oh, it's so pretty. Look at this yellow hair. Oh, one of my favorite colors. All right, I'm ready, horse. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, on the other side. Wait till it gets to a complete stop before you get off the horse. That's the safest thing to do. And we're stop. <laughs> that was so fun. Let's see what else we can find here. Wow, this is a huge jumping pillow. <laughs> Come on, let's see. Whoa, super bouncy. Can you imagine if this was really a pillow? Ooh. Good night. Ugh, ugh. 
Whoa, let's see, what can I do on here? Whoa, I can do one of my all-time favorite things, a cartwheel. Ready? Woohoo! Oh, I can also do a round off. <laughs> Whoa, hey, you can jump with me. What's one of your favorite jumps? You can do this. Woohoo! You can do it on the other side. Woohoo! <laughs> I'm so excited to make blueberry lemonade. I already made a lot of lemonade right here. To make lemonade, you need lemons, and you need sugar to make it sweet because lemons are pretty sour, and you need some water. But I think we need one more lemon to go into this lemonade. So let me cut one here. I'll show you how you get the juice out. And remember, only grown-ups should be using knives. Okay, so cut this in half, like that, and this, is a juicer. So we're gonna add that to the picture that I already made before. Yum! Okay, and my favorite part we have some juice from the blueberries that you helped me pick earlier. We washed the blueberries and we juiced them and now I have some yummy blueberry juice to add to this lemonade. All right. Whoa. <laughs> Isn't that such a pretty color? All right. Now we'll take a spoon and stir it up. Mmm. Smells sweet and fruity. Okay, I think that's pretty good. And I have a cup here so I can taste it. I have to make sure it tastes good. All right, whoops. <laughs> and, oh, I should add some extra blueberries to make it really special. Mmm. Okay, let's see. Oh, that's really, really tasty. Oh, I love blueberries so much. Okay, so I picked blueberries. I made blueberry lemonade. What's the other thing that I wanted to do? <gasps> Find sunflowers, that's right. I wonder if there are sunflowers around here. I have these binoculars. They'll help me look a little closer. Let's see. Get a closer look. Come on. I found the sunflowers. Oh, there's a really big one down here. Wow, it's so pretty. See, the inside looks like the sun and the petals all around look like sun rays. Isn't that cool? Like a big, beautiful sunshine. And speaking of sunshine, did you know that sunflowers are attracted to the sun? So if the sun is shining over here, a sunflower will look like this. <laughs> and if the sun is shining over there, the sunflower will look like this. <laughs> That's so cool. Oh, they're so beautiful. So I think we did everything that we planned. Let's see, we picked blueberries, we made blueberry lemonade, and we found sunflowers. We did it. Thank you for your help. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> well, we'll see you next time. Bye. It's me, Mika, and today we're at the Kennedy Space Center in Merritt Island, Florida. We are going to explore space shuttles, space rockets, and have so much fun. Will you come with me?
Well, let's go. Hey, check it out. A rocket garden. Do you know what a rocket is? It's a vehicle that launches stuff into space so that we can learn about other planets and galaxies and stars. <laughs> hey, will you count the rockets with me? Let's do it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And do you see the big one laying on its side? Nine, there are nine rockets. Hey, let's get a closer look. Come on. Whoa, this is gonna be really cool. This rocket right here, can you see it? It's called the Delta II. Isn't that a cool color blue? Whoa, this rocket has gone to space over 150 times. That's a lot of times. And if you look at the top, you can see the American flag. And if you look even higher, it has a shark face. <laughs> Isn't that so funny? It's a shark rocket. Wow, it's gone to space a lot. That's a hard working shark rocket. <laughs> Let's keep exploring. Come on. Wow, the space shuttle Atlantis. Let's go inside and get a closer look. Come on. Whoa, look at this. <laughs> wow, it's so, so big. This is the Space Shuttle Atlantis. This space shuttle has been to space multiple times. And it's the last space shuttle that's been to space. And we're in the same room with it. How cool is that? Oh, come over here. You see the front part? It kind of looks like an airplane, but it's not a plane. It flies, but it goes all the way to space. And it's called the Flight Deck. Astronauts can sit in there, and there's all kinds of buttons and controls so that they can navigate through space. You know what's really cool and what really helps them navigate? Do you see those white holes? It's kind of hard to see. Well, those holes track stars. They're called the star trackers. Have you ever looked up into the night sky and looked at stars? Can you imagine if you looked up and saw a space shuttle? Whoa, that would be amazing. It's so cool to look at. There's a lot of different shapes. I see a red triangle up there. Circles, squares. It kind of looks like a puzzle. Huh. Wow, let's keep going. Whoa, check this out. It's a live video of the Space Shuttle Atlantis. We can get a little more information. Here, let me move it so you can see it a little better. Is that good? All right. Hmm, what should we learn about? Ooh, the mid-deck. What happens in there, I wonder? Oh, this is where the astronauts do their cooking and eating and sleeping. They actually make food and sleep and live on the shuttle just like you do at home. That's so cool. And, oh, the flight deck. Ha, there's some astronauts right there. View features, yes please. Whoa, see, that's inside. You can see the seats where the astronauts sit and there's controllers and buttons and switches so that the commander and the pilot can control and steer the space shuttle. Whoa, I cannot imagine sitting in a space shuttle and not pressing all of those buttons. <laughs> that would be really hard to do. Wow, hey, do you wanna get a closer look of a flight deck? Well, let's blast off and go, ready? Three, two, one. Welcome to the flight deck. Whoa, there's 
there's a lot to look at, isn't there? Well, the front part is called the forward station. And the back part is called the aft station. And aft means rear, so the back. Wow. I think I'm gonna sit down. Oh. Whoa. Okay, look at me. I'm Pilot Mika. Pilot Mika, getting ready to go on a mission. Let's go on this flight together. <laughs> Woo, I can press all of these buttons because it's just pretend it's not real. So let me just get that uh, ADI landing gear, get the nose in place, check the cabin, enable, fin so one, two, three, power on, power on, power on, power on, power on. Here we go! I can see so many stars! Whoa! Being a pilot of a space shuttle is really fun! <laughs> Whoa, there's more buttons back here! Oh! It must take a long time to learn what all of these buttons and controls and knobs mean. I wonder how long it takes an astronaut to learn what every little button is for. Whoa. Huh. Kind of looks like something you would use on a video game. And there's a whole other side. Look at these screens. There's lots of numbers on these screens. Look, oil, fuel. What happens if the space shuttle runs out of gas? Are there space gas stations? <laughs> Whoa. There's more stars over there. Wow. Oh, I think we're coming in for a landing. Everyone hold on tight. Ooh. We're here. We landed nice and safe. Thank you, Pilot Mika. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> hey, up here. <laughs> Ready? Three, two, one. Blast off! Woo! <laughs> fast and really fun. Whoa. Hey, now we're at the bottom of the space shuttle Atlantis. This is really neat. We were able to see the top, but now we're at the bottom. Whoa, look at the wing. It's really, really big. Have you ever made a paper airplane? You know how when you make a paper airplane, you can make it to go really fast, or really slow, or really high, or really low, depending on how you fold the paper and make the wings? Well, engineers had to work really hard to figure out how to make wings that would soar into space. This is a delta wing. Pretty cool, huh? <laughs> oh, come down here. That says, United States. And the United States flag is right there. See? Red, white, and blue. <laughs> Whoa, come look at this. Whoa, do you know what this is? This is a smaller version of the space shuttle Atlantis. See, it's right there. It even says Atlantis under that American flag. So see the orange part in the middle? Right there? That is the external tank. And that's what holds all of the fuel to help the space shuttle go into space. And there's two rockets on the side. Will you count them with me? One, two, two rockets. And these rockets are rocket boosters to help the space shuttle boost into space like this. Three, two, one. <laughs> Let's look over here. Whoa! I bet you've seen these before, but way smaller. Yeah, and they're really big tires. And these tires right here actually went to space. <laughs> See? The picture right here? There's three sets of landing gear on a space shuttle, each with two tires. Learning about space is so fun. Come on. Whoa, look how big.
big this telescope is. Have you ever seen a telescope this big before? <laughs> this is the Hubble Space Telescope. Do you know what a telescope is? It's a device that allows you to see things really far away. So, oh, like I can see the space shuttle Atlantis way over there. <laughs> but this one is massive and it's orbited over 300 miles from Earth, allowing us to see images of space. <laughs> In fact, this telescope has sent hundreds of thousands of images of space back to Earth. That way we can see what space looks like. And see these things on the side? They kind of look like wings, but they're solar panels. They attract the sunlight and then turns it into usable energy. This is the coolest telescope I have ever seen. <laughs> I love space. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> I'm a space shuttle. <laughs> that was so much fun today learning about space shuttles and space rockets, especially the space shuttle Atlantis. We got to go really close to a real space shuttle that went to space. What an amazing day. Thanks for learning with me. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Great! M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. Well, I'll see you next time. I'm blasting off. Three, two, one. Hey, it's me, Mika. And today, I'm at the Kennedy Space Center in Merritt Island, Florida. Look, I'm even wearing a space suit because I'm going on a very special space mission. <laughs> My plan is to experience a spacewalk, experience landing and driving on Mars, and going to Mars space. But it's all simulation style, which means I'm not really going to space, but it's sure gonna feel like it. Will you come with me? Oh, let's go. Hey! Hi! Who are you? I'm Daniel. Oh, hi Daniel, I'm Mika. Hi! <laughs> so what do you do here? I'm an educator here at Kennedy Space Center. So oh. I teach kids all about science, technology, history, a lot of really cool topics. Wow, you must know a lot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, what is this? Uh, this is actually a 3D model of the International Space Station, the ISS. ISS, okay, so that stands for International mm -hmm. Space... Station. Station. You got ISS. it. ISS, cool. Oh yeah. Now, it's really, really big. It's about as big as a football field. Whoa, that is really, really big. Yeah. And what's this long part in the middle here? So the long part in the middle is called the truss segment. Ah, oh, the truss. OK, yeah. and what does that do? So that holds the things like the solar panels, a lot of cool instruments and experiments. The astronauts usually just live in the middle. Uh -huh. They don't usually go out there all that often. Why would they need to go out there? Well, sometimes you got to repla uh, repair stuff or replace things. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Now, something we also have really, really cool here is a simulator that'll kind of show you how astronauts actually train to go out there. Really? Yeah. Could I try? Totally. Oh, let's do it. Whoa, Daniel, what's all this? So these are all our tools and equipment and replacement parts that we're going to use in our simulator. Wow, that's going to be awesome. Oh, yeah. What's all in here? So there's tons of different things. We have different wrenches and different mm -hmm. equipment. One that's very important that you're gonna use today is this one right here. Oh, hey, it looks like the letter T. Yeah, that's actually where it gets its name. It's called the T-handle wrench. Oh, makes sense, T-handle wrench, oh, okay. Yeah. We actually have a bigger version of that. It's this one right here. Whoa, and look at this. It looks like the letter L. And that's what its name is, L-handle wrench. Oh, L-handle wrench works out. Easy to remember. Oh yeah. Whoop. This way. There you go. You got it. Okay. Now we're just going to use this little one today, but okay. we have other things that we can use to replace stuff. We have something right here called a dust environment. This Ooh. one is to try to capture micrometeorites and particles in space and dust and debris. Wow. We have this little one right here. It's an electronics module. It's huh. for computers and stuff like that. Looks complicated. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm going to give you an easy one to deal with. It's called a vibration detection system. 
Whoa, what does that do? Careful, it's very heavy, okay? okay? So that detects if the station shakes or shimmies or anything kind of crazy like that. And that would be very, bad? Yes, okay. it'd be very bad. Okay, so this okay. is super important. Yes. Okay. So what's gonna happen is that when I put you in the chair, okay, mm -hmm. we're gonna find that on the truss, uh -huh. and then you're gonna replace it. Wow, cool, okay, yeah. I can't wait. And I'm gonna give you this little one uh -huh. to replace it. We can test it right now so you get a little better understanding before we go. Okay, okay? let's test it out. So you're gonna grab onto that. Uh -huh. Okay. Now when you put it inside, it's kind of like a screwdriver. Okay. You put it in and push it straight down. There you go. Okay. And then you're gonna turn it halfway. Halfway, like that? Yep, there you go. Okay. Now when you do that, it's gonna come out and it's gonna fall down. Okay, So good make to sure know. not to let it fall on you, okay? okay. Then I'm gonna give you the new one. You're gonna give me the old one. Okay. Okay. And then when you put the new one in, you're gonna do the same thing. You're gonna push and half turn. The other way? Yep. Ah. And then that new one will be in place and you've replaced something. Oh, awesome. Okay, well, let's do it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, buckling in. Oh, the seatbelt is very much like the one you would use on an airplane. Yeah, exactly. Okay, nice okay. and tight. Now, you're in our microgravity chair. This is what we're gonna use to kind of simulate our spacewalk. Yeah, that's right, okay. microgravity. And for a spacewalk, you use your hands, not your feet. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Now, I want you to have your head all the way back against like that little okay. pillow. Okay, I'm gonna rock you back. It's gonna feel like being in a dentist chair. Ooh, okay. okay. So, rocking you back. Okay. All right. Feel okay? Yeah, nice and cozy. You ready? Yeah. Okay, starting in three, two, one. Now it's really loud, Ooh, okay? Yeah, it's a little loud. Yeah. Now I'm gonna push you underneath. Whoa. Okay. Now you can reach your arms up. Okay. Okay. And I want you to catch the truss. There, so got you got it. it. Now you can try moving up and down. Okay. Just use your arms though, remember, no feet. Ooh. Yep, so you're at the bottom. Now try moving all the way up to the top. Notice how easy it is to move? Yeah, yeah, it's really fun. Yeah. Cool. And it feels like I'm floating. Wow. <laughs> wow. So, I want you to come right here to station 108. Okay? 108. Because we got oh. a job to do, not just having fun, okay? Yeah, here it is, 108, ready for my job. Yeah, so we're gonna replace this instrument right here, okay? Okay. So I'm gonna give you some tools, remember? This is awesome. I'm working on the truss like a real astronaut. <laughs> so do you see the old vibration unit in front of you? Yep. I'm gonna give you the T-handle wrench. Okay. And you're gonna take it out. Remember, don't let it fall on you. All right. Okay, so push yeah, up. Yeah, this needs to be replaced. Good thing I'm here. I am very good at replacing these old things. Ugh. There you go. Old one's out. I'll Next. take the old one. <laughs> Here's the new one. Okay. Okay. Whoop. Turn it around. You got it. Okay. That goes there. Yep. Okay. Put it there. Push it in. Push Whoop. it straight up. Turn your handle wrench a little tiny bit more to the right. Okay. A little bit more. Okay. There you go. Now And then talking. let go. And you're all good. All right there, buddy. That one's good to go. Perfect. <laughs> I'll take the wrench back. All right. Okay. But hey, we finished our job. Awesome. Good job. I'm going to get you out of the chair, okay? Okay. So. Whoa. Stay right there. You can let go. Okay. okay? You're floating away from the station. Oh, no. Bye. <laughs> wow. I could take a nap in this chair. Well, you, you can now that you've done your job, <laughs> okay? But bringing you back down to earth. Three, okay. two, one. Welcome oh, back. That was a quick ride. Oh, yeah. Hello, Earth. Okay. And there you go. <sighs> Thank you so much for letting me experience that. Yeah, no problem. That was really cool. So, I got to feel what it would be like to do a spacewalk. Now I want to know what it feels like to travel to Mars. To Mars? Do you have that here? We do. Really? Yeah. Oh, can we do it? Totally. Oh, let's go. Yeah. <sighs> come on. So, come on over this way. Oh. I can't wait to see this. Oh, yeah. Come on. <gasps> Whoa. Whoa, look over there. It says Lander Rover Simulator 1. That's so cool. Yeah. So over here, we have a really amazing simulator. <gasps> wow. 
Okay. Yeah. This is gonna show you how you're gonna fly to Mars, how you're gonna land on Mars, and then how you're gonna drive <laughs> on Mars. That's okay. amazing! And yeah. remember, it's a simulation, so it's not real, but it's gonna make me feel like I'm really traveling to Mars. Yeah. Now, we have two different positions, okay? Because whenever we do anything with NASA, we try to have a buddy system. Always okay. have a backup. So okay. two people. Yes, two people. So we have a commander mm -hmm. who's gonna fly the thing. That's uh, you. Yes, okay. okay. And then we have a pilot who's gonna drive it. In this ah. case, it's a robot, so you're okay. Wow, so you yeah. fly there, land, and then you can drive? Yeah. That's so cool! Right? Do you wanna go inside? Yes, I do. Okay, so Bye. head on down the stairs. Okay. okay. And then you're gonna sit in this seat right here. Okay? Oh! There you go. Whoa. It's cool, right? Yeah. Yeah. Now, we're gonna make sure you're as safe as possible. Okay. okay? So if you look up above, you probably notice something very similar. Oh, yeah. It looks like a seat that you would sit in on a roller coaster. Yeah, exactly. Okay. We wanna make sure you're as safe as possible. Okay, that's okay. Good. So I'm gonna lock you in. Okay. Okay, what I want you to do, put your arms up and you're about to go on a roller coaster. Okay. Okay. And then the restraints are gonna come down. There we go. Nice and secure. All good? Feel yeah. safe? Okay. Now, what's gonna happen is when I close this door, we're gonna start the simulator and you're gonna fly and do all the cool stuff on Mars. Okay, okay. awesome. Ready? Yes, I'm so ready. Awesome, okay. So I'm gonna close the door now. All Bye. Right. See you soon. I'm going to Mars. <laughs> Whoa. Wow. It really feels like I'm getting ready to go to Mars. <laughs> this is amazing. Here I go. Welcome back. That was amazing. Whoa, did you see that? You did wow. a great job. Thank you. Now I'm gonna get you out of there, okay? okay? So first things first, the restraints. We're gonna raise those up, okay? There you go. Whoa. Good job. Okay. And you come on out this way. Be very Whoa. careful though. <laughs> you can use the handrail, yeah. That was wild. Did you see me flip upside down? <laughs> Whoa. You okay? Yeah, I'm good, I'm okay. good. <laughs> so is that what it feels like to land on Mars and then drive on Mars? A little bit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's a good wow. simulation, right? Yeah, that was really fun. Thanks for letting me experiment oh, with no that. Oh, no problem, yeah. So for that, you got to drive to our Mars Base 1 in uh -huh. the simulation. Yep. Do you want to see our simulated Mars base that we actually have here? Oh yeah, that's last on my list. Awesome. All right. Want to go? Yeah, let's do it. Let's go. <laughs> cool, come on. Come on over this way. Whoa. <laughs> wow. So welcome to our Mars Base 1 Botany Lab. Oh, thank you. I've never been in a space like this before. Yeah, do you like it? Yeah, it's very cool. Lots of plants in here. Yeah, we have tons of different varieties of plants because we want to see what types of things we could grow on Mars. Oh, why would you want to see what can grow on Mars? That's a really good question. So if we're gonna go to Mars, like we plan to do, so we can work and do scientific experiments, mm -hmm. we gotta test what we could have to eat on Mars. Because we can't oh. bring all the food we're gonna take there. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Now, growing on Mars is really difficult. It's not like Earth. Oh. Yeah. Is there not dirt on Mars? Well, there's dirt on Mars, but when it comes to Mars, it doesn't have the right things that plants need to grow. Oh. So, do you happen to know what things plants need to grow? Yeah. They need light and water 
and dirt or soil packed with nutrients, and you need the right temperature. Yeah, so they need tons and tons of stuff, and it's all very specific yeah. to the type of plant. Mm -hmm. Now, when it comes to Mars, it has dirt, but there's no nutrients in it. Oh. So if I just went outside and grabbed any old dirt, it's not really gonna simulate how well it works on Mars. Oh, well what does it feel like? What's the dirt feel like on Mars? Well, I have a really good example. So this is oh. some of the stuff that we use. Oh, cool. It's a simulation of what Martian dirt or soil is like. So this isn't really from Mars? No, it's not really from Mars. Huh. Look at this. Whoa. Kind of feels like a bunch of little rocks or little pebbles. Yeah. Huh. So it's like a lot of clay and iron. It's not good for plants, sadly. So we have to add in nutrients, plant food, so that way they can grow a lot easier. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. All right, cool. Yeah. Now, like I was saying, we've grown tons of stuff in here. Yeah, I can uh, tell. We've grown things like lettuces and even tomatoes. <gasps> I love tomatoes! Wow, can you imagine eating a tomato that grew on Mars? <laughs> it's wow. super cool, right? Yeah. Now, other things that we've grown I want to show you are some of our peas. So come on over this way. So these are some of the peas that we've actually grown. We've tested different types of plants, but we also want to test how those plants grow in different conditions. Okay. So some of the things you mentioned before of growing include water. We have water in the trays. That helps them grow. All right. And then we have some nutrients in some of the arcelite, the dirt in there. Mm -hmm. And then we have different types of light even. Oh, different types of light. Oh, yeah, it does look different. Yes, yeah, so you can put your hand underneath. So down here we have like this weird purple magenta. Ooh, I love purple. Yeah. <laughs> it's got red and blue little lights. And then up here on top, we have oh. some white light with it. It's a little bit different. Yeah, it looks very different. Yeah. So we want to test how the plants grow in different light conditions. Oh, like these plants up top are growing a lot higher than these plants here on the bottom. Yes. So, hey, we know now for the peas to use more of these lights rather than these ones. Oh, just always experimenting. Yeah. And you can even see some of the ones that we've Whoa. kept growing even longer. They're super, super high because they have that nice light. See, they're growing towards the light? Yeah. Wow, they really like this light. Yeah, yeah. Wow, well, thank you so much for teaching me all about space and what it would feel like to land and drive on Mars and spacewalk and now Mars base. Yeah. <laughs> You've been awesome, thank you. Thank you. Well, have a good day. I'll You're see you around. <laughs> Bye. Thanks, Daniel. Let's go. Wow, we did everything on my list. What a great day. We got to experience a spacewalk experience landing and driving on Mars, <laughs> and we got to go to Mars base. Wow, space is so amazing. Thanks for learning with me today. <laughs> well, that's the end of this mission and the end of this video. But if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool. <gasps> Will you spell my name with me on Mars? <laughs> okay, M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. Oh, I gotta go, that's my ride. Bye. Hi, it's me, Mika. And today we're at Nailed It DIY Studio in Orlando, Florida. DIY means do it yourself. And today we're gonna build and make art. Oh, I can't wait, come on. Oh, look at all of this stuff. These are all signs that people have made and that's what I get to make today. Oh, look, this box says meow. <laughs> oh, I wonder if it's something that you could put cat treats in or cat food. Oh, and look at this one. <laughs> all guests must be approved by the dog. <laughs> that's really funny. <laughs> Oh, I see some pink colors down here. Let's see how many colors they have. A lot. Oh, I wonder if they have two of my favorite colors. Do you know what they are? <laughs> oh, they're purple and yellow. <gasps> and they're right next to my best friend Blippi's favorite colors. Blue and orange. Huh, that's cool. 
These are all the different wood pieces that you can use to make art. Oh, look at this one. It's pretty small. You can have a small sign that says, welcome. <laughs> or, whoa, look at this. This giant rectangle could make a really cool sign and it could hold a lot of words. Maybe it could say something like, Welcome, friends. Come on inside for snacks and games and good times. We love our friends. Welcome. <laughs> and here's a square. One, two, three, four even sides. And there's bigger squares up there. Hmm. Oh, cool. A circle. A small circle and a really big circle. Hmm. Which one should I choose? I think I like this one, the medium stack square. That's number 07. We have to remember that, 07. Okay, come on. Oh, hi Margie. Oh, hi Mika. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm pretty good. I'm excited to make art today. Awesome, so did you pick a size? Yes, number 07. Perfect, and did you wanna add anything to that? Oh, um, oh, maybe that silver hook right there. Okay. Oh, and can I also have that bow tie for my best friend? <laughs> Absolutely. So we have your station set up over here. You ready to get started? Yeah, let's do it. All right, let's go. All right, let's go. Okay, we have everything we need. We have lots of cool paint, two of my favorite colors, purple and yellow. Oh, well, this one's called dandelion. Fancy. And we have pearl and latte. We also have a paint roller, easily put on the paint. And we have some sponges. We have silver hooks. And we have our crown stapler, our power stapler, and the stacked wood piece that I picked out. See, it's actually four little pieces. And when they're stacked together, it makes one beautiful square. <laughs> And what are these for? So these are actually to hold the wood stack pieces together. Oh, okay, makes sense. So what's the first thing we need to do? So your first step is to put a line of glue on each one and then flip them over. Okay, I think I can do that. Okay. Now what? So we have these lines here, and those oh, yeah. are actually where you are going to put the staples. Oh, so these lines, it's like a little guide. Exactly. So first we are gonna put our safety glasses oh, on. Oh, right. If we're gonna use a power tool, we need to be nice and safe. And remember, only use a power stapler if you are with a grown-up. Whoa, you're really good at that. <laughs> Think you can do that? Yeah! All right. So I'm gonna follow the black lines. That's my guide. All right, good teamwork. You are a pro. Oh, you did thank good. you. <laughs> All right, so oh. now you're gonna flip it over. And there you have it. Look at this perfect square. What's the next step? So the next step is we're gonna take it to the sanding station where you're gonna make it smooth. Ooh, let's make it smooth, <laughs> come on. So this is the sander. Okay. What you're gonna do is put one hand here, one hand under here. Mm -hmm. There is a power button that you wanna push. Okay. Once it's on, you are gonna run it over the whole thing until it's as smooth as a piece of paper. Oh, all right. Well, why do you want it super smooth? It helps the paint stick to the wood. Oh, okay, so let's make this Super smooth, time to sand. So we are going to choose your base color. So we're gonna look oh. at your stencil. <gasps> yes, I can't wait to see. All right, so this is the stencil we have for you. Wow, look at this. An ice cream cone, one of my favorite sweet treats. And that's my name and my headband. Oh, and this is gonna be my bag. And this other stencil will help make it really look like my bag. Oh, I love it. 
Okay, so for the base, um, I'm thinking purple. Yes, yeah. that is a good color. Okay, so I can just put it everywhere? Yep, so you're just gonna squeeze it over the top of the wood. Okay. Okay, and I get to use this really fun paint roller to spread it all over the wood. So you're gonna paint the top and then all of the sides. All right, now we just wait for it to dry? Actually, we have a way to dry it quicker. Oh, how? So we are going to use this blow dryer. <laughs> You've probably seen a blow dryer before. It's to dry your hair. So there is that. You are gonna blow dry it on the base setting. Okay. <laughs> cool. Is it ready? Ready to go. Okay, turn it to base and let's dry! Okay, now what? Oh, it is dry. Cool. So now what you wanna do is sand it until it's smooth again so that we can put the stencil on. Okay. This time I'm gonna give you a piece of sandpaper as well so you can sand over the top of it. Nice. Oh, cool! It's purple sandpaper and it's really rough. But this rough piece of paper will make this smooth. Hey, those are opposites, rough and Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Bobby pin. <laughs> All right, like this. So you're gonna go back and forth over the whole thing, just like that. Yes, perfect. Okay. All right, so your board is nice and smooth. We are ready for the stencil. Yes, all, all right. right. So the stencil has a couple of layers. We are going to peel the white layer off first. Oh, it's like a giant sticker. Yes. All right. So I'm gonna hand you one side. Okay. And we are gonna center it on your board together. I think that looks good. What do you think? I think it's pretty good, yeah. Okay. So we're just gonna stick this on. Okay. I'm gonna give you a squeegee. A squeegee? Yes. I know what that is. This is your squeegee. Yeah. What you want to do is run it over the whole thing. And you see how it turns a little bit darker? Mm-hmm. That's how you know it's really stuck to the wood. Cool. And this is going to push all the bubbles yeah. out. Yes. Okay. Bye, bubbles. <laughs> so now that it's all stuck to the wood, what I want you to do is peel this top layer off. Okay. We're actually gonna start from over here. Ah. Uh -huh. And pull down towards you, slow and low. Slow and low, my favorite way to go. Oh wait, oh, come on, sticker. Well, I did it. <laughs> wow. That looks cool already. <laughs> all right, so now we're ready to paint. Yes, all right. So, hmm, I'm gonna start with the ice cream cone and I'm going to use pearl. That way it would look like vanilla, one of my favorite flavors. So what you wanna do is dip the wide end of the sponge, that end of the sponge, into the paint. Okay. Take a look at it. Does it look wet? Yep. That's too much paint. Oh no. So what you wanna do is dab it off and you can use the paper or you can use the plate. Okay, I'll dab on the plate there. All right, look at it now. Does it look wet? Nope. You're good to go. So now you're gonna just dab up and down. Okay. For the whole thing. Like this. And is it okay if it gets on the blue part? Yes, it is. Okay. It's a stencil, so that part is gonna come off. All right. So let's cover this ice cream cone. Okie doke. Perfect, so now you can pour your next color for the cone. Ooh, and the cone, I'm going to make that a latte. You look like a sugar cone. I'm gonna be careful because I don't want it to get on the top of the ice cream cone. But even if it does, we can always fix it. Oh, you know what? I like your attitude, Margie. 
Okay, that cone's looking pretty tasty. Yes, it is. All right. So what color did you want to paint your name? Oh, my name, I want it to be yellow. Yes, I love it. All right, so let's go ahead and pour the yellow. Okay. Some yellow there. Wide end. Dab, dab, dab. You got it. Oh yeah, now I'm feeling like a pro over here. Now, let's see. My headband is yellow. So I'll just use the same yellow. <gasps> Margie! What happened? I need two more colors for my bag. You're right. Do you know what colors are on my bag? Yep, blue and orange. All right, so go ahead and pick the blue and orange that you want. Okay. Down there. Oh. This is good, and oh, this. Ooh. Yeah, this will look cool. Okay, do we need the other stencil yet or no? Not yet. So okay. what we're gonna do with this is once we peel this up, we'll put this one on so it really makes it look like your back. Awesome. So I should start with this one, I think. Dab, 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 and get the whole bag. Perfect. All right, so take a look at it. Do you like it like that, or do you want to do another coat? Oh, I think I like it like that. Perfect. So we are going to give this one good blow dry again. Okay. And then we're ready to peel. All right, let's do it. So this time you are going to blow dry on the stencil setting, and just be careful, it is powerful. We don't want everything flying away. Okay, I'll be careful. <laughs> Here we go. Ah, it is powerful. <laughs> it's dry. So now it is reveal time. Oh, okay. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. So we're gonna turn it this way because we wanna peel the stencil against the grain. Oh, okay. Do you know what wood grain is? Uh, you can explain it. Okay. <laughs> so the wood grain are the lines that you see in the Oh, wood. that's right, yeah. So if the, if the lines of the wood are going this way, mm -hmm. we wanna peel this way. Oh, gotcha, against the grain. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. So you're gonna start with one corner and then peel down towards you. Towards this corner or each down towards you? So. Yes. All right, let's see how it looks. Whoa. Uh-oh, there's a little piece That's stuck. That's okay, it can rip, it can tear. That's totally fine. Oop, there we go. Check it out! So now we are ready to put the other part of your bag on. Oh, that's right! We have another stencil. So I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm just gonna peel the backing off and we will center it together. Okay. Look good? Looks good to me. Okay. All right, ready? Let's commit! Oh, we did it! <laughs> You're ready for your paint. All right, let's get the orange on there. That looks pretty good. Okay, do you remember what comes next? We have to dry it. Yes, okay. Okay, now what setting should I put so it on? So you're gonna be on the stencil setting. Makes sense. Here we go. It's powerful. There you go. Woo! Everything's about to fly. I know. <laughs> okay, so do you remember the wood lines? Oh yes, you wanna go against the grain. Yes. So we wanna go this way? Correct. Okay. There's my bag. <gasps> it looks so good. Oh, this is so, so cool. So now I just need two hooks because I wanna be able to hang my headband and my bag. <laughs> All right, so we have the hooks right here. Okay. I'm gonna have you pick two hooks out of there. Yep, two hooks, Whoop. Okay, we have one. 
two. So we are going to be using a power tool again. Okay, so, so we need our safety glasses. You know it, safety first. So I will drill the little holes to get the hook started and then you'll screw the hooks in. Sounds good. Let's put this one right here, okay? You're ready All for right. the hooks. Two holes, and here we go. So I can just twist them in, right? Correct. Almost there. There we go. <gasps> it's finished. <laughs> wow, look at the sign. I love it so much. Thank you, Margie, for all your help in helping me make this awesome Mika sign. You are so welcome. <laughs> well, I guess I'll see you around. Yeah, sounds good. We'll all see right. you next time. All right, have a good one. Thanks Bye. again. You're Bye. welcome. <laughs> <laughs> hey, wasn't that so fun making this really cool Mika sign? <laughs> Today, I got to build a sign, sand it, and paint it. Art is so much fun. <laughs> Thanks for playing with me. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Cool, oh, we can spell it right here on the sign. Ready? M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. <laughs> well, we'll see you next time, bye. Oh, hey, it's me, Blippi. And today we're at the Pacific Science Center in Seattle, Washington. This is gonna be so much fun, come on. Whoa. Look at this place. This place is awesome. Ooh, now we're in the butterfly room. Have you ever seen a butterfly before? Yeah, I love butterflies. They're so beautiful and light. Will you act like a butterfly with me? Whoa, look at him go! Whoa! <laughs> There's one right there. Hey, butterfly. Whoa. <laughs> Check it out! A butterfly just landed on me. So anytime they land on you, you don't want to touch them. And they're actually just being really nice. So you can be nice back to them. See? <laughs> I love butterflies because they're so bright and, and some are camouflaged though. Look, can you find one? This butterfly uses camouflage for its defense mechanism. Just in case if there's any predators, then the predators can't see it. <laughs> see? <laughs> Hi! All right, now I'm with Lorraine, and what are you gonna show us? So this here is a Madagascar hissing cockroach. I can take Ooh. it out for you. And what am I gonna do with it? You can hold it if you'd like. Sure, let's try Take it. Out. I'm about to hold a Madagascar hissing cockroach. All right, hold your hand out really still. Ooh. There you go. Oh, that's nice. I like this cockroach. Hey, how are you? Hey. Do you see it? See, I'm being nice to it, and it's being nice to me. Hey, how are you? What did you do today? Did you enjoy your food? Yeah. Ooh, now we get to touch some animals. But first, we need to wash our hands. So then our hands are nice and clean. Okay, I think that's good. Let's go, come on. Ooh, look at this. Wow. <laughs> Hey, what do we have here? Well, over there we have some anemones. 
They're really friendly and kind of squishy. You're doing a really good job petting it with one or two fingers on the side. We don't really want to poke it right in the middle because that's its mouth. Oh, cool. Ooh, look at this one. So the last ones are really soft. I wonder what this is going to feel like. Whoa, it looks like it's closing itself up a little bit. Blippi, it, it might think you're food. Ooh, that's funny. Oh, look at this one. What's this? That over there is a sea star. How does it feel? Whoa. Kind of bumpy, maybe? Yeah. Bumpy and 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 kind of small spikes. The last couple were really soft, but this one is hard. Those little dots are made out of the same stuff that seashells are made out of. Ooh. So even as though a sea star doesn't have a, its own seashell, it's kind of like it has little bits of a seashell. Wow, that's pretty cool. Well, thank you so much. My pleasure. <laughs> bye bye. Bye. Oh, I found the queen. Wow, there's so many honeybees in here. Hey, don't be scared of honeybees. All they're trying to do is make some honey. Yeah. Have you ever had honey before? <laughs> yeah, it's so tasty. <laughs> Look at what it is. This is the spot where you can do the bee dance. Are you ready to learn the bee dance? I'll teach you. Okay, in the middle here, you go and do a little wiggle. Then you go this way, flap your wings. Yep, because we want to make some honey. In the middle, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. And then go this way, flap your wings. And then since you're back in the middle, you wiggle, 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 and go this way. And then you keep doing it until you're really tired. All right, ready? Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Flap your wings. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Flap your wings. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Flap your wings. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Oh, I'm tired. Oh, that was awesome. Good job. Oh, now we're in the living things exhibit. Oh, look. Hey, look at what it is. It's a crayfish. Do you see it right there? Oh. Here's one right here. Hey, how are you? <laughs> Ooh, and up top there's some fish. Hey fish, are you just swimming around? Yeah, they are. <gasps> oh, look over here. Some giant grasshoppers. Ooh, grasshoppers can jump really high. I bet they live in the grass a lot of times. Eh, that's why they're called grass. Hoppers. A lot of times they live in the grass and they hop really high. <laughs> Let's go see what else there is. Whoa, look at this room. Another part of the Living Things exhibit. Whoa. Yeah, do you see these? Whoa, interesting. These are naked mole rats. Wow. They're like rats, but they have no fur or or hair or scales or anything like that. That's why they're called naked mole rats. <laughs> oh, and an axolotl. Check this out. Whoa, see that? That's an axolotl. Whoa, so interesting. Kind of looks like a salamander mixed with a fish. But the cool thing about axolotls are if they lose a limb, like their arm, then from there, they can regrow it back. Woo! <laughs> Check out this little person, or guy, or girl, or I don't even know, but this is a turtle. Wow. Hey, how are you, turtle? Are you having a good day? Are you having fun? Yeah. <laughs> you sure do look like you're having fun. <laughs> See you later. Whoa. It's kind of dark in here, but that's okay. This is a green iguana. Can you see it? Whoa. It's just relaxing. 
having a good time. <laughs> All right, see you, Iguana. That right there is a dinosaur. They don't live on our planet anymore, but they used to. Look at it. It kind of looks like a velociraptor. Will you act like a velociraptor with me? Whoa, another dinosaur. Whoa, this dinosaur. That's its name right there. It's really big. Hey, look at its head. <laughs> Hey! See? It kind of looks like it's wearing a helmet. Just like when you and I ride bicycles, we wear helmets. <laughs> cool! Oh, here's some more dinosaurs. Whoa, look at that one. That is a triceratops. Do you know why they call it a triceratops? Yep, because it has three horns on its face and head. Let's count them. One, two, three! <laughs> All right, see you later, Triceratops. Whoa. Hey, another dinosaur. Wow. Hey, dinosaur. Oh, this dinosaur right here was a herbivore. <laughs> see, these plants, that means it eats plants. <laughs> and plants only, it doesn't eat meat. And look at what's on its head. <laughs> it kind of looks like a shark fin. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> Whoa, check this out. Whoa, this is a massive footprint. Okay, let's compare my foot to this dinosaur's foot. Ready? <laughs> Its foot is way bigger than mine. It's even way bigger than two of my feet. Whoa, another dino. Check it out. This is a Stegosaurus. Whoa, do you see those plates on its back? That's for its defense mechanism. Wow. Hey, Stegosaurus. <laughs> So many cool dinosaurs in here. Whoa! This dinosaur is so scary. It's the king and queen of the dino land. Whoa! I'm gonna act like this dinosaur, okay? Will you do the same? Ready? <laughs> I love acting like a dinosaur. <laughs> Ooh, now we're gonna do the high rise bike. Oh, all right, come on, come here. You gotta buckle up. Whoa. I'll also tell you a few quick things before you go. Okay. Uh, just make sure you're going at like a walking pace. You're always going forwards and just keep pedaling the whole time. Okay. Uh, hands are optional. Oh, hands are optional. Here I go. Whoa. You would think I would fall off because it's a really thin rail, but I didn't because the weight is really heavy and it's really far away from me. Here I go. Woo! <laughs> Whoa, look at this. Interesting. This looks like a giant circle. <laughs> and this is actually called the water wheel. It's kind of just like how a hamster runs in their wheel. I'm gonna do the same. 
but it's gonna grab water from the bottom and throw it up over the top. Ready? Here I go! What's this? Ooh, this is the water power station. Water is getting shot out on the front of this little water gun. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> okay, watch. I'll make that spin. Yeah, we're doing it! Whoa! Okay. Whoa, what's that way up there? Do you see that? Yeah, that's the Seattle Space Needle. I think we should take the water power gun and try and shoot way up there. Here we go. <laughs> it's such a nice day. I wanted to give them a cool break of water, but it's too high up there. Let's go see what else there is around here. Pretty fun! Whoa! Look at this area! You can use these water squirters to squirt inside this clear cube! <laughs> Alright, let's see what else there is! Whoa! Look at this! Alright, I wonder if I put this right here. Yeah! See? The water is pushing this gear around. Okay, let's try this one. Whoa, look. Both of these are going in circle. The red one and the yellow one. Ooh, come on. I love playing with water. Whee. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Wow. <laughs> Okay, look in there, let's go. Ooh. Welcome, come on in. Hey, look, it's a little tree house. Here I go. Hello. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. It's a bunch of spirals, ups, downs, lefts and rights. Here we go. Whee! Whoa! 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 <laughs> oh, this is so much fun. Oh, the noise room. Come on. Whoa! This room is a room that you can make as much noise as you want. First thing I'm gonna do is yell. <laughs> now, let's use the things around us to make some noise. And if we're lucky, maybe it will sound like music. <laughs> Woo! Look, some shiny bowls. right up here. Whoa, this area has a lot of colorful bricks. Yeah, see? Right over here. All right. Timber! <laughs> Whoa, 
A taller one! Let's count how many there are. This is a lot of stories of bricks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen! Eighteen bricks coming down! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, that was awesome! Okay, let's uh, organize these bricks in their different colors, okay? Okay, since we made a mess, we need to take the green bricks, put them over here, okay? Okay, there's the green bricks. And let's now take the blue bricks and put them right there. Awesome. Perfect. Oh, hey, look. Here's some brown bricks. Let's put them right here. Hey, here's a red brick. Let's put it right there. Here's some more blue bricks. <gasps> Look at this one. What color is that? Yeah, this is brown. Let's stack it right there. Hey, look at all these. What color is this? Do you know what color this is? Yeah, it's the color yellow. Let's put these right over here. Okay, so when those 18 bricks fell down, they were comprised of these one, two, three, four, five colors. And those colors are green, brown, blue, red, and yellow. Good job. Let's see what other fun things they have at the Pacific Science Center. Let's go. You like numbers? Yeah, I do too. What about big numbers? Yeah, check this out. This is a big number. 76,383,232. Whoa, that's a big number. But when I push this red button, watch this number. It just went up by one. See, it's at three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Every time you push this button, it goes up by one. So if you ever come to the Pacific Science Center, you can see what number it's at, because I am going to leave it at 76,383,323. Wait, no. 320? <laughs> hmm. oh, hey, I'm just doing this puzzle of the moon. Okay, there's one. Let's see. Okay. Hey, there's another. Um, yeah, that looks about right. Perfect. We're almost done. Look. Yeah, this is our moon. We live on planet Earth. And we have one moon, and we call it Moon. <laughs> wow, how clever of us. Hey, look at what it is. This is a planet. Just like how we live on planet Earth, this is a planet in our solar system. And this is Saturn. <gasps> Ooh. And the biggest planet in our solar system is Jupiter. Whoa. It is really big. <gasps> Look at that. Come here. This is a space capsule. Watch your step. See? This capsule is where astronauts can sit in and go into outer space so then they can feel the effects of gravity and they can push all these cool knobs. Ready? Whoa! Whoa! Yeah, look, I just made all those things light up. 
Whoa, this is fun. Whoa, it's like I can see planet Earth all the way from out here. Whoa, hey mom. <laughs> Woo. It was just a mirror. Come over here, I'll show you some more fun that we can have with mirrors. Ooh, look at this. Whoa. <laughs> I call this the mirror dance. <laughs> I look silly. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> A bubble maker. All right, I'm gonna lift this up, nice and slow, and I'm gonna blow now. Yeah, I did it! Did you see that? That was awesome! I love making bubbles. Ooh, and you know what else I love? is taking a giant lever and seeing how distance way out here makes it really easy compared to, to lift up this weight compared to pull down right here. See, watch. Huh, interesting. All right, now let's move it way out here. Now I'll do it with one hand. Yeah, did you see it? Look, I'll lift it up. Whoa, that's pretty interesting. Whoa, hey, a cool mirror. Another one. Hey, hello, this is interesting. See, I'm upside down, but in real life, I'm right side up. Hello, hey, I see you. <laughs> Whoa, whoa. <laughs> All right, let's continue on. This place is so cool. Hey, what's this? This is a beach ball. What's it doing here? Flying ball. Feel the power of air in motion. Huh, interesting. Let's push this. Whoa! I wonder what happens when I plug this hole that's shooting up all the air. Whoa, did you see that? All right. Now I wonder what happens when I move it. Whoa! Oh, look, the ball's way over there. I just hydrated my body with a lot of water because what I'm about to show you <laughs> takes a lot of energy. I'll show you my Lance Armstrong hill climb. Woohoo! That was awesome! Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B L I. P-P-I, Blippi, good job. Special thanks to the Pacific Science Center for making this video happen. Bye-bye. It's me, Blippi, and today we're at Dig This in Las Vegas, Nevada. Whoa, ha ha. And today, you and I are gonna learn about the word crush. Do you know the word crush? Yeah, it means to destroy, pulverize, and just Smash thing! <laughs> Come on, let's go! Wait a second! Do you see what I see? Yeah! Eggs! Whoa! Three eggs! One, two, three! <laughs> I love eggs! But today I'm not gonna eat this egg. Today I'm going to crush this egg! Ready? Ha <laughs> ha
<laughs> okay, let's find some more things to crush. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Whoa! Look at what it is! It's a soda can! I think we should crush this! But be sure to never try this at home. And the only reason why I'm gonna do it is because I have shoes on. Alright, here we go! Whoa! Look at it! It's so small! Yeah! I love crushing things! That was awesome! Oh, hey! Perfect! Look at what it is! This is a watermelon. It looks like it's ready to be crushed! Oh! Are you ready? Oh! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! That's awesome! <laughs> Yeah! Look! The watermelon is crushed! <laughs> Alright, let's see what else we can find and crush! Oh! Wait a second! No way! There's a car right there! Let's crush the car! Alright! Whoa, 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 whoa! Before I crush the car, I need to wear my safety gear! Alright! Whoa! <laughs> I have a bright yellow safety vest. Perfect. Alright. And then I got my hard hat and safety glasses. Alright. Oh, oh, wait a second. This needs to be perfect. Okay, here we go. Oh! Alright. Let's give it a whirl! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> I'm trying to crush it, but it's not really working. Let's try the door. <laughs> oh, interesting. <sighs> I'm not getting very far. All right, one last one. All right, anywho, I have an idea. We need a bigger tool for this job. But before that, let's write crush on it. Perfect. All right, we have some spray paint. We have red, green, blue, pink, and black. First, let's take some white paint. All right, pour some in right there, and let's and let's give it a nice white base coat. All right, <laughs> yeah, woohoo, yeah. There we go. Perfect. A little bit more white right there. All right. Just 
two more letters. C R U. Let's use the color pink now. Last letter, C R U S. The color blue for the letter H. Oh, look! I wrote the word crush on it. All right, C R U S. H. Now we're ready to crush this. So let's get a big machine for this. Ha ha! And the perfect machine is a toy excavator. Whoa! What better machine to destroy and crush this car than an excavator? But wait a second. This toy can't do it. That's why I have a real excavator! All right, let's crush this car! Okay, first things first, let's keep this toy excavator right back there. Let's put on our headset. All right. Perfect. All right, and now let's put on our hard hat. Okay, so let's take our safety belt. Yeah, just like the seat belt in your car. Now that we're all strapped in, we're ready to crush.
I'm an excavator. Excavator. I'll teach you. All you gotta do is bring up your arm, like it's the arm and the boom in the bucket, and start to scoop. <laughs> That's fun! I've got a place where workers sit. It's called a cab, where they control the bucket to scoop and grab. I'm a whole regulator. I'm an excavator. Oh, can't you see that I work all day? Do you ever sleep? No time for. about the word crush with me. And hey, special thanks to Dig This in Las Vegas, Nevada. Well, see you later, kids. Bye bye Hey, we're at Just Play in Issaquah, Washington. Hey. Hi, have fun. Thanks. OK, come on. OK, first things first, before we play, we need to take off our shoes. Now that they're in the cubby hole, whoa. We get a play. Whoa, look at this. This is the color white, and you can climb on it. And they're kind of like a swing. Whoa! Whee! <laughs> hey! Whoa! Whee! Okay. What's this over here? Wow! These are green and white. And these ones over here are pink and white. Oh! Look it up here! Whoa. 
green balloons up here. Wow, this room has giant colorful floating balloons. Whoa, look at them. Whoa. color green. This balloon is the color red. This balloon is the color blue. This balloon is the color orange. And this balloon is the color yellow. Oh, oh hey, a pink one. Okay, I'm gonna go down the slide. Watch me, okay? I'll be right down. Okay, here I come, down the orange slide. Whoa! <laughs> so dizzy. Whoa, look up here. Wow! This is gonna be fun, come on. Wow! Look at this place. Whoa! Woo. Push the button, and then you put balls in here. And then they go to the top. Woo. You see how it's full? Okay. And then you can stand underneath it. You want to stand underneath it? Okay. Get ready. Here we go. Three, two, one. Whoa. Good job. A lot of colorful balls here. Whoa. Whoa. All right, cannonball! Whoa. 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 Look at all of these colorful balls! Whoa! Whee! <laughs> Whee! Whee! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> we have red ball. Orange ball, green ball, blue ball, pink ball, yellow ball, brown ball. Whoa, 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 look. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> okay, let's see what else there is. This place is so colorful. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. All right, follow me. Okay, now we'll go this way. Wow, okay, I'm taking you to a blue slide. Come on. Wow, look at this. This is a blue slide. Okay, I'll go first, then you can follow, okay? Ready? Three, two, one. Whoa. <laughs> okay, your turn, come on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoa, good job. All right, come this way, come on. Wow, good job. A giant chalkboard. Ready? Let's spell my name together. B L I P P I. Blippy. Okay. Come this way. It's a photo 
poo. So first, you put on some props, like this green hat, and this red guitar. Ready? Okay, here we go. Printing on demand. <laughs> That's so cool. All right, let's go, come on. Whoa, look at this. Hello. <laughs> wow, whoa, that mushroom house is so cool. Oh, okay, come here. Whoa, okay, come on. Let's go really fast, okay. We're almost to the top. Okay, whoa. Look at these pyramids right here. Whoa. They have smiley faces on them with their tongue sticking out. <laughs> whoa. Whoa, whoa. 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 Look at this. Look at this spiky ball. Wow. There's pink spikes, blue spikes, green spikes. Okay. Watch out. Whoa. <laughs> whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Get really close. Come here. Check this out. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> I almost got you. Okay, come on. Whoa, look at this. It's like a balance beam. Whoa! And we're like two stories, three stories up in the air. Whoa, we're really high. Whoa, okay. Oh, hey! We're at the slide. The big blue slide. Okay. See you go down. Bye bye. <laughs> okay, you can go down first, okay? <laughs> Whoa, that looked really fun. Okay, my turn. Here we go. Whoa! <laughs> that was so much fun playing at Just Play in Issaquah, Washington with you. All right, bye bye <gasps> Whoa! Today we are at the Florida Aquarium and this is going to be so much fun. Let's go! Whoa! This area, you can actually touch stingrays with two fingers, okay? Come on. I didn't quite get him. Oh, here he is. I touched him. And he's really soft. And it kind of has a little mucus type of feel, really slippery. Stingray? Wow, there's so many tropical fish in here. Oh, like that little guy. Ooh. Okay, let's go down here. Whoa, 
there's uh, hundreds of them. Look at the angelfish. No, hey. this is the tail. Ooh, this is a black and yellow fish. Hello. Wow. Keep, keep going. See the Oh, what's in here? Whoa. Look, they kind of look like rocks. See those? But they're actually alive. Okay. What do you do right here? Ooh, I think it's time for a picture. They have really long tails. Ooh, let's go on this side. Ooh, there's a big shark. I have a better place to see all these fish at. Hurry, let's go quick. Oh, it's coming close. Look at that one. different types of sea creatures under the aquarium, I got to go on top of the aquarium and do something really special. Whoa! Look at this place! We are on top of the coral reef at the Florida Aquarium. This is a little behind the scenes for you. I've never been on top of an aquarium before. Oh, look at who it is. What's your name? Oh, hi, I'm Eric, and you're Blippi. Yeah, wow. I'm Blippi. I can't believe you're visiting. Yeah, what do you do here? Oh, uh, I'm a curator here at the Florida Aquarium. Okay. We're right on top of the coral reef, and curators take care of animals, and we get care, and it means everything from round the clock health care to, guess what? what? Feeding time. Ooh, yeah. I love food. I love food too. It's lunchtime. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it is? It is. It's lunch for the sharks, it's lunch for our big turtle flip you're going to meet for all of the thousands of fish that are in our environment here called the Florida Coral Reef. Woohoo! All right, I think it's time. Let's go. Flippy, we're heading over to the feed station right now, and let me introduce you to Alyssa. Hello. Hi. How are you? Good, how about you? Good. So we are about to be feeding the deep side of our reef tank. Okay. We got a lot of different fish here, but we have a lot of different fish in the reef that like to eat. So right there. Take a good sniff. That's some fresh Ooh. fish there. Yeah. Yum. Yeah. <laughs> Nice big mackerel. Ooh. So what we'll have you do is put on some gloves. Oh, I should have done that first. <laughs> it's super simple. Take a big scoop of fish. Okay. And you're just gonna throw it out into the reef. And you'll oh. see a bunch of fish swim out. All in four. Yeah. All right. Well, so can I try now? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. I think all one is all I need. Big scoop. Yeah. 
what's in here exactly? What? So right there we have some squid, uh -huh. we have some herring, we have clam and night smelt. Oh, the whole mix. Can I sneak a little for myself? Yeah, lunch is not going to come fast. <laughs> All right, where to? Over this way, yep. right field. That's a sports turn. Yeah. That looks tasty. All that right. looks like some good squid and mackerel there. Yeah. Three, two, one. Hey, Bolivia, you're doing a great job. Now let's go down below and see what it looks like to be a fish underwater watching all that food come down. Okay, Ready? let's go. Let's go. Lisa, take us from here. After feeding all of the sea creatures from above the aquarium, Eric took me back down below so we could watch all of the sea creatures eat all of the food I just fed them. It was so spectacular. And then I went on over to the wetlands exhibit. Whoa! Look! A duck! It's so cute! Do you see it? Quack, 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 quack. Can you make the sound of a duck? Quack, quack, quack! This area is where they have the otters. Look! Whoa! Look at them doing backflips! This place is so beautiful! Whoa! Whoa! A python! Whoa, look how big it is! Jeez, that's scary. Come on! Ooh, some cute birds over here! These are spoonbills. And they're white and pink! Look, he's looking for food! Fish are so big. Whoa, get really close. Can you see it? <sighs> Such a big fish. And here's some more fish. Go up really close to the glass. Let's see what else they have here. I had such a great time at the Florida Aquarium. Next time you're in Tampa, Florida, you can go check out some sea life. Two bucket trucks, and in this video, we are going to learn about yeah, bucket trucks. Woohoo! Woo! Okay, now I'll show you the parts of the bucket truck. Come on! Woo! Look at this. A compartment. Whoa, there's so many cool things in here. Like a tape measure, and ooh, a flathead screwdriver. <laughs> so many other cool things in there. Ooh, another compartment. Whoa, giant snippers. Snip, snip, snip. And, whoa, look at this. Really heavy mallet. <laughs> That's heavy. Okay, shut that. Woo! Look! A fire extinguisher. Just in case if there's a fire anywhere. <laughs> Ooh, and some 
road cones up here. Oh, look down here. Whoa, this is a stabilizer leg. They go down and stabilize the truck while the operator is really high in the sky in the bucket. <laughs> okay, let me show you up here. Wow, look at this. This is a go light and it moves, see? <laughs> okay, check this out. It's like a spotlight, watch. Whoa, 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 <laughs> it's kind of like it's a disco light. <laughs> Come on! Whoa! Look up here. These are the lower controls that operate the boom in the bucket from down below right here. Ooh. And spray paint? Wow. I bet that's useful. And whoa! Look at these! Giant bolts! Wow, that's huge! And then we have some more cones and some folded up road signs. There's a lot of them in here. And come back here. Wow, see this is the bucket. That's where you stand and then you go really high in the sky. That is so cool. Come here, I'll show you inside the bucket van. Whoa. Wow, there's other cool things in here. Like, oh, another screwdriver. Ew, ew. <laughs> okay, here, take a peek. Wow, whoa, look. I set out some stuff that was inside the bucket van. Okay. We have a pedestrian headlight. It says stop and go, and it counts down right there. Ooh, a socket wrench. <laughs> and a small adjustable wrench. A medium adjustable wrench. And a giant adjustable wrench. <laughs> this is called a crow's foot. Wow, it's used for odd shaped nuts and bolts like that. <laughs> Whoa, isn't that cool? Hmm, look over here. We have a red light, a yellow light, and a green light. Oh, and speaking of green lights, look, this is the green light button tester. Just like when emergency vehicles like police cars and fire trucks, when they need to get somewhere really quick, they have a button inside that shoots a light, whoa, into this thing, ah, it's really bright. And then that turns the lights green. Whoa, okay, ooh, another road cone. <laughs> oh, a road sign. And speaking of safety, we have our safety equipment, like my bright orange vest. Whoa. See? So orange. And then, whoa, look at this. This is a harness. This is used. So then you wear it while you're up in the bucket. So then if anything ever happens, you're strapped into the bucket. So, strap this right here, okay? And then, oh, one around your belly, perfect. And then two down here, <laughs> got it nice and tight. And another down here, wow. Now I feel really safe, but still, oh, jeez. This is kind of heavy, but I got to put on my gloves, bright orange gloves. One, two, and last but not least, my hard hat. Whoa! <laughs> Here we come. Going really high in the air. You guys see the traffic signal lights? We're just going to do some maintenance and make sure that they work. Okay, it looks like the lights are in perfect working order. Now, 
now, we're going to head on over here to the black thing over there. And that is a sensor. And it senses the magic green light button. Now that we're at this little black sensor, we just need to clean it and then we need to test it. And this is used for when emergency vehicles push their magic green button to flash lights and then it'll turn green. Watch! here looking at the street light. It's an LED street light. And it wasn't working, but we fixed the wiring. Fixing the lights up in the sky, there's a handyman. Way up high on that neon sign, high above the land. And everybody wants to know, how did he get way up there? in Las Vegas, Nevada. Come on. Wow, this place is so colorful. Before we play, we need to take off our shoes. <laughs> All right, one shoe, two shoe. Now we're ready to play. Hello! <laughs> Whoa, I'm in a little house. Ah! <laughs> Ooh, it's a yellow ball. Watch this. <laughs> and a blue ball. A green ball. A red ball. Oh, and an orange ball. I'm gonna jump inside. Whoa! 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 So many colorful balls! Whoa! Wow! 
What is this? It's a dinosaur! And this is a pterodactyl! Listen! Dinosaur, dinosaur, oh, bye bye, pterodactyl! Dinosaur. Let's see what else we can find! Whoa! This is another dinosaur, and this is a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Dinosaur, dinosaur, oh, I love dinosaur. <laughs> I like Tyrannosaurus Rexes. Bye bye. <laughs> Whoa! 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 Look! This is a stegosaurus. Let's act like a stegosaurus together. Okay, ready? Dinosaur, dinosaur, oh, I love dinosaur. Bye bye. Wow, so many colorful balls. Let's keep playing. Whoa, oh, look, this is a police car. Vroom, 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 vroom. Whoa, Ooh, look, it's a garbage truck. Wow! I love Garbage Day and garbage trucks. Whoa! This is a giant cement mixer. Look, you spin this right here. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> Woo! A fire truck. Gotta put out the fire. Wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. Ooh. A dump truck. Whoa. Oh! Whoa! <laughs> Ooh. And yeah, a vacuum. <laughs> All right, nice and clean. Whoa, look at this giant orange spiked ball. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Ooh, look at this. It's a blue ball. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> and this is a small, orange and blue spiked ball. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa, look at this. Hello. Uh, <laughs> Come on. Whoa, look, a slide. All right, here I go. It was so much fun! Oh, it's so colorful! <sighs> I'm gonna climb to the top! Are you hungry? Yeah, I'm really hungry. I went shopping earlier. Look at all of these fruits and vegetables. Yum! <laughs> Let's see what we're gonna cook together. Ooh, oh look, hey! Gotta put out the dishes first. The plate and the bowl.
Ooh, look at this. I cooked you some spaghetti. All right, yum. Let's season it. Mmm, yum. There you go. Ooh, and you know what else I have? Do you like pizza? Yeah! Okay, look at this. Yum! That looks so tasty! All right, let's take the spatula. Cut the pizza out. Ooh, look at that piece of pizza for you. All right, perfect. There you go. Oh, it's so hot. Just came out of the oven. Ooh, to make it even hotter, we should put some hot sauce on it. Oh, but before we put some hot sauce, let's try it out. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. has wheels on the bottom. <laughs> I'm gonna let it roll. Here we go. Yeah, that looks awesome. Oh, here's another one. I wonder what would happen if I rode it. All right, here I go. Whoa. Oh, that was so much fun. Oh, here's another one. Here we go! Get ready! Oh! Oh, yeah! Ooh, look at this structure! Come on! Ooh, look at these steps! They're so colorful! This is the color black. This is a new color. Whoa! This is maroon. This color is the color pink, blue, green, purple, red, and gray. Whoa. Look at this. Wow, it's a slide. Okay, here I go. Ooh. Whoa! off the wall and hit me in the face. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Watch out. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Hello. Whoa, look at this yellow net. Whoa. And look at what it is over here. Wow, it's a giant red slide. Whoa, hey, and look at what's in the way. Whoa, that's a lot of big soft blocks. It's time to go, but they're in the way. Hmm, wait a second. Why don't I slide down and plow them over? Are you ready? All right, here I go. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, oh, that was so much fun playing at Kinderland Indoor Playground in Las Vegas, Nevada. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, you know what to do. Yeah, just search for my name. Let's spell Blippi together. Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. All right, bye-bye. 
it's me, Woody. And today we're at the Seattle Children's Museum. This is gonna be so much fun, come on. Woo, check this place out. Hey. Hi. Have fun. Thanks. <laughs> come on. Whoa, this place is awesome already. Ooh, look at this. Hey, fish. <laughs> Ooh, this is where these fish live. Just like how you might have a bed at home and a place to play around in the gravel. These fish have these plants to swim around and those rocks to play in. Look, <laughs> that one just came out. Hey. All right, let's go see what else there is. Oh, hey, a post office. I'm gonna dress up like I'm a post office worker. <laughs> oh, there we go. A lot of times they wear the color blue, but then some companies wear the color brown. Oh. Here we go, here we go. I'm gonna go collect some mail. <laughs> All right, that'll be 50 cents. <laughs> here we go, let's put it in the mailbox. All right, this says letters. Okay, let's put it in there. And maybe we'll find that later. Okay, let's go see what else there is. We have to take all this stuff off first. Oh, little snug. <laughs> okay, there we go. Nice and organized. Come on. Whoa. Construction zone. Whoa, look at this. House paint. This paint is the color red. This paint is the color blue. And this paint, <laughs> this paint is the color yellow. All right, there's a bunch of stuff over here, but first we need to get on our safety equipment. Okay, I got my bright orange safety vest on. There we go. And my hard hat. <laughs> and it's the color yellow. All right, let's go over here. Oh, hey, look. A stick of wood. Let's put a bolt through there. And let's grab another one. All right, there we go. They're both inside the holes. And then, what do we need now? See, it's not very tight. They can still come apart. Yeah, it needs a nut. Um, just like this, see? This is a nut. All right, let's screw it on. There we go. See? <laughs> it's kind of like a hammer. <laughs> oh. oh, and right over here? I'll keep that right here. Whoa. Nice organized blue things. Whoa, look at this. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> okay, let's put one right here. Let's build a tower. Okay. Go. Loop that in. Stick it in the holes right there. And then. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Alright, now let's build it really high. Since these are soft, I can actually take my hard hat off. There we go. A big blue tower. Okay. There we go. And for the final bit, the beautiful tippy top thing. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Let's go see what else there is. Hey, look at where we're at now. This is the eye clinic. They have a lot of glasses on the wall, see? <laughs> Just like mine. But mine are the color orange. 
Oh, wait a second. Looks like the eye clinic has some mail. Let's put that down. Open it up. Oh, hey, this is the letter we sent to ourselves earlier. <laughs> Good job. All right, there you go, receptionist. Okay, what else? Oh, oh my. This is a way to check your eyes to see if they're in good health. So, let's bring these around. Whoa, watch out. <laughs> okay, here we go. First, you put your chin right here, just like this. Hello? Yep, I'm ready. Hi. <laughs> okay, and then you bring the eye thing right here, and then you look through. Okay. Hello? Hey! Whoa, look at what I see! Oh, it's kind of like a video game. <laughs> hey! Whee! Whoa! <laughs> okay, I think my eyes are really healthy. I can see a lot of things. Whoa! Hey! Look at what I see now! Glasses over here! Woo! Hey! What one should we try on first? Let's do... Let's do these ones. Yeah, see? <laughs> They're the color blue. Well, this is light blue, and this is dark blue. Okay, there we go. <laughs> How do I look? I can see really good now. <laughs> okay, I'll put them back, because I only need one pair of glasses. Okay, that was pretty fun going to the eye doctor. Well, let's check out what else there is around here. Woohoo! Wow, look at where we're at now. This is Imagination Studio, where you can use all of your creativity and imagination to create some art. Oh, look at this, the painting area. But before we paint, we need to get on an apron. Okay, let's do, yeah, let's do a blue apron. I like the color blue. <laughs> blue is one of my two favorite colors. Can you guess the other favorite color? Yeah, it's the color orange. All right, now that we have the apron on, we can Van Gogh right over here and create some art. Ready? Call me Blippi Van Gogh. <laughs> Did you see the colors that I used? I used the color blue, green, red, and yellow to make this amazing, beautiful art piece. <laughs> okay. Ooh, what is this? Hey. I am now going to make the Blippi Mona Lisa. Ready? water and spray it down. Whoa! <laughs> okay, and let's take our squeegee and squeegee it off. Oh wait, what am I doing? <laughs> I did it on the other side. <laughs> that was so silly because the glass is clear. It confused me. Okay, let's take the water, spray it off. Now, let's squeegee it off. Ho oh, ho! Oh, perfect! Now it's super clean! Oh, hey! Look! 
more things to do art with. So this says recycled. All of these items that you can use to tape on things, glue on things, wow, are recycled. So that means they're pulled from something else to use on art. Oh, oh, just like this stuff. Wow, it's so shiny. Whoa, 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 yeah. <laughs> okay, I'll put that back a little later, but for now, let's create some more art. Whoa, just like this big white piece of paper. I think we should write my name together with the color blue, just like my apron. Ready? B L I P P I Blippi B L I P P I Good job! Ooh, what's over here? Yeah! Some more art supplies! And this looks like a piece of clay. Whoa, it's really hard. Ah, ah. And it's kind of a shape of a circle. So, I think we should squish it down. Roll it out. made it really thin, so it can be a lot bigger. Whoa! <laughs> oh hey, some cookie cutters, or in this case, clay cutters. Hey, what shape is that? Yeah, this is a heart. Let's cut out a heart in the clay. Okay. There's what's left over. And check this out. Poke it out. Oh, there it is. Look, it's a heart. Do you know why I made a heart? It's because I love you. And I just wanna say thank you so much for being my friend. And you are very special. You are loved by many, many people. Well, stay loved and keep loving other people. All right, let's go see what else they have here. Oh, it's showtime, it's showtime. I have to get my outfit on because we're at the theater, at the Children's Museum. How do I look? <laughs> yep, okay, let's put this on. This is my outfit for the show. Ah, oh, jeez, oh, the people have arrived. Okay, this looks really good, perfect. I'm going to make all of them so happy with my performance. Okay. Oh, wait. Hold on. I need my makeup on. Okay. It's showtime. Let's go. Time to go grocery shopping. <laughs> Come on. Hey, look at what it is. It's a grocery cart. Whee! 
Whee! <laughs> All right, let's go. Wait a second, what am I doing? I pushed this thing. I don't carry it. Oh, hey! Ooh, brrr. This area is really cold. Oh, a lot of fruits and vegetables. Let's get some. Ooh, watermelon. Hey, a plum. An orange. Oh, bananas. Apple. A pear. Oh, a strawberry. Hey, here we go. Here's some vegetables. A tomato. A carrot. Bunnies love carrots. And so do I. <laughs> oh, corn. Yum. I can't wait. Ooh, a red pepper. Huh. An onion. These make food taste really good. Hey, a potato. I like mashed potatoes a lot. And it looks like a cucumber. Nice and refreshing. Huh. All right, let's weigh some of these. See this? This is a scale. You put some food in here, and then you can see how heavy it is. All right, here we go. <laughs> Whoa! Look, it weighs one and halfway in between one and two. So that means it weighs one and a half pounds. <laughs> You might use kilograms in your local area, but where I live, we use pounds. All right, let's continue to shop. Some beans. Oh my, look. Some tasty bread goods. Um, let's do, let's do sandwich bread. Yeah. There we go. Oh yeah, come over here. There's still some more beans, like chili beans. Ooh, hey, these aren't beans, but they're pretty similar. They're sweet peas. Ooh, hey, here we go. Oh, let's see. Oh, hey, some cheese, yum. And, huh, some milk. All right, this looks like a lot, right? Look, look at all of our food we got at the grocery store. Okay, time to check out. Okay, here we go. Let's start scanning these things. And we'll put them in the bag, okay? Almost done. The last item. Go make some food. <laughs> Yay, I'm so happy we got all these groceries. Now we can make a yummy lunch. Okay, first, let's set these down right here. Okay, stay there. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. After going to the grocery store, playing in the mud, going to the playground, 
anything and everything like that, we have to wash our hands before we eat, or even wash our hands before we make food. So, let's turn on the water, and then we wash our hands for about 20 seconds. about 20 seconds. That'll be fine. Okay, all right. Here we are. We need, yeah, we need, uh, that looks a little too big. I'm not that hungry. So let's take a, wait a second. This is a bowl. Yeah, this is a bowl. We need a plate because you and I are gonna make a sandwich. Perfect, one green plate. Let's put that right there. Let's start out with some, some bread. See, two slices of bread. One, two, perfect. All right, then let's put some yummy lettuce on there. Yum. Okay, so we have some bread and some lettuce. Oh, a tomato, yeah. Let's take the tomato. So we have bread, lettuce, and tomato. And then, hey, here we go. We could put some onions on there. Yeah, nice and chopped. Okay, so we have bread, lettuce, tomato, onions, and let's do pickles. Yeah, yummy pickles. Okay, so we have bread, lettuce, tomato, onions, uh, pickles, and then uh, we need, yeah, we need just a little bit more. How about some red peppers? Perfect. So, on our sandwich, we have bread, lettuce, tomato, onion, pickles, and red pepper. Okay. Put the last piece of bread on there. Oh, it looks so yummy. Okay, let's go to the table so we can eat our yummy lunch. Okay. Oh, hey, look. We have ketchup and mustard. Okay, let's put some of that on there. <laughs> Perfect. Sandwiches. Sandwiches are great because you can put a lot of different things on them. You can try this sandwich or even a different sandwich at home. Hey, I have an idea. What if we took some of those vegetables that we got at the grocery store and we grilled them on the campfire? Yeah, that's a great idea. Let's see what we have. Oh yeah, onions. I love grilled onions. Oh, we could try some Grilled cucumber, I guess. Um, a carrot. Doesn't hurt to try. <laughs> Let's see, what else is there? Oh, yeah, corn. And, and some red peppers. Okay, let's take this to the campfire and grill them so then we can try them out. This is like a forest. You and I should go camping, and then we can grill our vegetables on the campfire. Come on. Whoa, look at this. Wow, it's like a waterfall. See, water is way up top, and then it falls down below. And then you can put your hands in it like this. Whoa, but you don't want to drink it. No, 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 no. <laughs> Oh, whoops! Uh, I dropped the corn! Hey, I have an idea. Maybe we can wash off the corn with the water. There we go. Now it's all clean. All right. Oh, look! A rock! wonder what's under the rock. Whoa, look! It's a salamander. Whoa, they're so slimy. <laughs> Okay, what else is over here? Whoa, 
It's a giant log that's rotted out. Look. Hello. Hey. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Whoa! Hey! <laughs> Look! Another rock right here! Let's open it up! Oh! Look at what it is! It's another animal! This right here is a frog! Wow! Let's act like a frog! Rabbit! 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 <laughs> Alright! Let's continue on! Ooh, it's really dark in here. Kind of scary. Let's go. Oh, hey, look. It's a marmot. Hey, marmot. You're really nice. Hey. Wow, it feels really nice. Oh, okay. Oh, the campsite. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Look, it's the fire at the campsite. My tent is right there. <laughs> All right, for now, let's get warmed up just a little bit. All right, let's put the vegetables on the campfire. Campfire. Okay, there we go. All right. Oh, yeah, this is going to be so tasty and healthy because they're vegetables. I love vegetables. Do you love vegetables? Yeah! All right, I'm gonna take a nap. Bye-bye! Oh, wait a second. I can't forget about the vegetables. Okay, now I can take a nap. Ooh, look down here. There's a bunch of wood things. Oh, it kind of looks like a trough. See? Hey, I have an idea. What if we took these things like this and then like this and we rolled a ball down it. Yeah. Hey, here's some balls over here. Okay. I have four balls. Let's count them. One, two, three, four. Let's count them again. One, two, three, four. Good job. All right. Here we go. Whee! <laughs> yeah! All right, now I'll do the next three all in a row. Ready? Three, two, one! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! Good job! Come on! Hey, a slide! Go up the stairs, then you can go down the slide. Up the stairs, down the slide. Up. <laughs> down. Good job. Come on. Whoa. Up here looks like the ocean area. See this? This is like seaweed and kelp. And this is like a dock. See how there's birds up there? Cool, cool, cool! And right here down below, there's water, like we're fish. Come through here with me. Whoa! Whoa, good job! We just swam in the ocean together. <laughs> Come on. Awesome. Because 
because they can go really long and connect with each other. See? <laughs> wow. <sighs> well, this was the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you search for my name with me? Wait, let's spell it together first. B-L-I-P-P-I, -I, Blippi. Good job. See you soon, bye-bye. Hey, it's me, Blippi. And today, I'm in the country of India. Whoa, India is so much fun. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I am having so much fun. Oh, look, flowers. We have a red flower and a yellow flower. They smell so great. We'll put that back right there. <laughs> I love being in India because everything is so different from the location that I live in, United States of America. Oh, look, coconuts. <laughs> Whoa, check these out. These are a fruit. They fall from the tree and I'm gonna get one. <laughs> we have to wait our turn. Hello. Can I have a coconut, please? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh. And look at this. These are rupees. This is the currency they use in India. Wow. Thank you. All right, thank you. Mmm, so tasty. Oh, and what is this? Whoa, this is a rickshaw. Some countries call them tuk-tuks. And today, you and I are gonna learn about rickshaws and tuk-tuks. Let's go. Now, let's learn the exterior parts of this rickshaw. Come on. Ooh, look at this. The vehicle you probably ride in probably has two front wheels and tires, but rickshaws and tuk-tuks only have one front wheel and tire and one headlight. <laughs> That's silly. Ooh, and speaking about the number one, look, this is the windshield wiper. And there's only one windshield wiper. <laughs> it pushes the rain off the windshield. Come here. <laughs> Look, like I said, the front only has one wheel and tire, but the back has two, just like a normal vehicle. One, two. Oh, and how rickshaws and tuk-tuks get all of their power is from the engine. Check this out. <laughs> Whoa, look at that. What a powerful engine. <laughs> Whoa, interesting. <laughs> all right, let's say bye to the engine. Put that right there. Oh, come over here. And up here, this yellow part, this is the canopy. It keeps you inside nice and clean and dry from the rain and the wind when you're driving and sitting inside the rickshaw. Whoa! Now we're inside the rickshaw, the auto, the tuk-tuk. Are you comfy? Yes. Yeah. Looks so roomy. Whoa, look at all the room. 
Whoa. Oh, hey, what's this? This is the meter, huh? Let's flip this down. Now we're ready to ride. Whoa. And up here, whoa. This is the steering bar of the rickshaw. This is the throttle. Ring, 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 ring. This is how you steer. And this right here, this is the clutch. Pull this in, push this forward, and then you can change gears. There's four gears. One, two, three, four. Ooh, let me show you something. Oh, gotta get the key out. Yep, the key, put it in here. But before you turn, you have to put your foot on the brake. So push the brake. Turn the ignition. Whoop. Whoop. Wrong key. <laughs> okay. Watch this. Listen. Got it. <laughs> yeah! Woo! <laughs> yeah! It's a transportation song. Everybody here is moving along. It's a transportation song. You can walk, you can run on your own two feet You can ride in a car going down the street You can fly in a plane up in the sky You can zip along on a motorbike I'm a pilot flying a plane I'm a conductor conducting a train Taking you from place to place It's a transportation song Everybody here is Transportation You can ride go-karts round and round the track You can roll on skates down a pavement path You can float on a boat on the open seas You can gallop on a horse you can kai -yai. I'm a driver steering a car I'm on a boat navigating stars To take you places near and far It's a transportation song Italy has the gondola There's camels in the Sahara In Thailand just to speed things up They all take a ride on a little tuk-tuk It's a transportation song Everybody here is moving along It's a transportation song Transportation song Everybody here is moving along It's a transportation song It's a transportation song Everybody here is moving along It's a transportation song Now everybody come along <laughs> Bye bye! learning about rickshaws with you, also known as tuk-tuks. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you search for my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Flippy, good job. Hey, it's me, Flippy. Ooh, and look at what I have. Hmm. Some tasty vegetables. They were really healthy. But I'm really full now. And after you eat a nice, healthy meal, guess what you get to eat next? Yeah, dessert. And today, we are at Bohm's Candy in Issaquah, Washington. This is gonna be so tasty. Come on. Oh, look at this place. Yum. Oh, I don't even know what that is. But it looks so good. Whoa! Hey, some caramel. Ooh, some chocolate. Yum! Hey, I think we should learn how to make some of these tasty treats. Woohoo! Ooh, chocolate, chocolate, chocolate. I sure do love chocolate. Hey, look at it. Look at it come out of the spout right here. Do you see? Whoa! <laughs> and look at what I have. Ooh! 
a plastic thing that has some letters on it. Do you know what letter this is? Yeah, it's the letter B. Do you know someone's name that starts with the letter B? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> my name does. Blippi. Hey, I have an idea. Let's fill up one of these bees with warm chocolate. Ready? Whoa! 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 Look at it! <laughs> it just scored a bunch of chocolate right there. Okay, now we need to take it right over here. And we need to shake it and get all the air bubbles out of it. And use this chocolate paint brush. Or a chocolate brush. <laughs> Okay, turn it on. Whoa! All right, now that all of the air bubbles are out of here, let's put it in the fridge. Hey, do you know why we're putting it in the fridge? Yeah, because remember earlier I said the chocolate is really warm and we need to cool it down so then, it gets nice and hard. Chocolate is hard when it's cold. See? No chocolate on my fingers. All right, now, the next step. Put it on this tray, and we need to pop it out. Okay, here we go. Uh, uh. <laughs> yeah! Look, a chocolate bee. B. What other words can we think of that start with the letter B? Um, brown? Yeah, this chocolate is the color brown. What about B? Whoa! Whoa! Yeah, like a bumble B. <laughs> okay, let's put it in this box. <laughs> Box also starts with the letter B. Okay. Bye bye, B. <laughs> there we go. Hey, speaking of boxing up chocolate, check it out. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Whoa. Look at what she's doing. She's putting a lot of chocolate in all of these boxes. Oh, good I job. Am indeed. Thank you, sir. Are you having fun? Oh, Blippi, I'm having a lot of fun. I really am. <laughs> cool. Well, this is what it's going to look like when she's all done. Isn't that beautiful? It sure is. <laughs> okay, now let's complete the process. So, we need to take this box of chocolates, put this pad on top, and then this flyer <laughs> Bones Chocolates. Put it right on top, and then let's put the top of the box on, slide it inside the plastic, push it onto the conveyor belt, shut it. Ooh, perfect. Okay, now we need to take this heat gun, and this is called shrink wrap. It tightens up the plastic. Makes it nice and tight. There we go. <laughs> oh, this is kind of fun. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. That's looking real good. Okay, there we go. Let's flip it to the back. And then, once it's nice and warm and tight, then you put on a bow. Yep. Just on the top. Then on the bottom. And voila! See? Got a beautiful box. Beautiful and box start with the letter B. And Bones does too. <laughs> now I can take it home. Woo! Ooh. B L I P P I. Flippy. Candy looks so tasty. Oh, it's on a really long conveyor belt. I wonder how it works. Oh, can I try? Sure. <laughs> Look over here. 
Let's take two pieces. Let's put one piece there, and let's put the second piece right there. And then it goes down this really long conveyor belt. Oh. And this adds chocolate to the bottom. Wow. <laughs> That's cool looking. <laughs> Ooh. And then it dries a little right here. And it goes really slow. Do you see how slow it's moving? Oh, hey, look! Another part that adds chocolate to the bottom. Wow. That's really fascinating to watch. Now that there's two layers on the bottom, the next part is right here. What are you doing? I'm covering the Mount Rainiers with a lot of chocolate so there's no holes. Ooh, so they're putting a lot of chocolate up top. Oh, look. That looks tasty. Meet me on the other side. What are you doing? I'm adding white chocolate snow to the Mount Rainier. Ooh, check it out, white chocolate snow. Whoa, it's looking tastier and tastier. And then, right here, it cools down. And then, meet me over here. What are you doing? Putting these on, putting these chocolates on the tray. Oh, these chocolates that are complete now go on the tray. Watch. Oh. Wow, check them out. Yum. <laughs> Look at them. They're like little triangles with some snow on top just like Mount Rainier. Wow, <laughs> yum. Ooh, look, I have some chocolate in this plastic tube. I cut the bottom off and now I can make a masterpiece. Ready? Um, whoa, it's coming out. <laughs> okay, let's draw a triangle. <laughs> Oh, there we go. Good job. Now, how about a rectangle? Ooh, that rectangle kind of looks like a chocolate bar. Hey, here's a chocolate bar. Let's spell my name together. <laughs> Ready? B L I P, P, I. Yeah, look, Blippi. That looks tasty. What else can we draw? I know, a bunch of squiggly lines. Whoa, <laughs> wee. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh. There we go. When that dries, it's gonna be super tasty. Whoa! Look at this! This is a giant bar of chocolate! Whoa! It's really heavy! Oh! Jeez! Huh. Have you ever seen a bar of chocolate this big? <laughs> I sure haven't. Okay, what I'm about to do is gonna get really messy. So, the first thing we have to do is wear an apron. Perfect. So let's tie it on the back. Ooh, now that I have an apron on, woohoo! <laughs> we can smash this bar of chocolate. But hey, this looks like a hammer, right? But this isn't a normal hammer. 
this hammer is only used to smash this big bar of chocolate. Ready? <laughs> yeah! Yeah! That was awesome! One more. Another one. There we go. <laughs> now, it's in a lot smaller pieces, but still really big. <laughs> so, let's take this over to the heater. But first, we need to take the cover off of the heater. And then, oh look! <laughs> they did go. it for me! Thank you! Ooh, check out, check it out! Look! Whoa! That looks like some tasty chocolate. This heats up the chocolate, so then it melts. All right, here we go. Look. <laughs> All right, let's put the tray back. And then we need to take this big bowl and put it right down here. Because when I open this, a lot of melted chocolate's gonna come out. Ready? Whoa! Whoa! Oh, that looks so tasty. Ah, whoa! It's really heavy. Okay, let's take the chocolate up here. And what we're gonna do is make some rocky road. Do you know what rocky road is? Really tasty. All right. So. Since that chocolate was really warm, we let this cool down just for a little bit. See? Here's some tasty chocolate that's just slightly cooler. All right, so we have some chocolate, and then we take some nuts. Looks pretty good. And then we also take some marshmallows. Let's put the marshmallows in first. And we mix them all up together. Whoa, okay, here we go. Whoa, look. Whoa, yep. You have to mix the chocolate and the marshmallows really good together. So then you see no white, you only see chocolate. We're almost there. Whoa, all right, looks Pretty well mixed. Do you see that? Looks like chocolate covered marshmallows. <laughs> All right, now we need to put the nuts in there. So let's sprinkle them in, stir it up. Okay, here we go. Let's stir it up. Now that looks tasty. All right, so the next thing we have to do is take it out and put it on the table. It's gonna get really messy. So the first thing we should do is put on these really big gloves. <laughs> Look how big these gloves are. They go all the way up my arm. Whoa! <laughs> and then let's put on this other one. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> I have two giant gloves on. One, two. <laughs> and then let's put another set of these small gloves on. Now we are ready. Let's give it one last stir. <laughs> okay. Put the mixing spoon over there. And what we're trying to make are really big logs that look like this. Do you see this? Whoa, that looks tasty. So let's take this, put it on the table, make it into a really long mound. Ready? Whoa, ah, it feels so mushy. And it smells so tasty. <laughs> there we go. Oh. Oh, this is so much fun. OK. 
Okay, just a little bit more. Okay. This is a bowl that I sure want to lick. <laughs> okay, a little bit more. All right. I think that's all of it. So, put that right there. And now I'm going to shape it into a really long mountain type of shape that has a mound. Oh. Does that look good or does that look good? <laughs> All right. So now what we do is let it dry and then we enjoy. Good job. Check it out. Now that's what I call Rocky Road. Ooh, do you see what I'm doing? I am washing my hands and I'm washing them really good because what I'm about to do requires me to use my hands. All right, let's dry them off real quick. Oh, oh this is gonna be fun. Oh. All right, now my hands are really clean. So I'm gonna use my hands as thermometers. Do you know what thermometers are? Thermometers help you check the temperature. Come through here. Whoa. <laughs> and the temperature of this chocolate that I'm gonna use is really important. And that's why I'm not using any gloves so I can touch the chocolate and make sure the temperature is perfect. Do you see this chocolate right here? It's really warm. So let's take some and put it on the table. Yeah, just like that. <laughs> perfect. I'll put that right there. And then you spread it around just like this. And what we're doing right here is making truffles. Oh, she's really good. Go look. Wow, that's fascinating. See, I'm moving my hand around the chocolate to make sure it's the perfect temperature. All right, feels pretty perfect to me. So then with my left hand, I'm going to grab some of this peanut butter. And I'm going to take some of this white stuff, put it right there, spread it around. Oh, I have to keep moving my right hand. It's pretty tricky. It's kind of like rubbing your belly and patting your head at the same time. Okay, let's see. <laughs> it's really hard. <laughs> and it feels so smooth. Okay, that's going to be the closest I can get to it. See? Kind of looks like a perfectly round circle ball. Okay, let's put it in my hand. Boop! <laughs> oh, whoa! <laughs> okay, and then looks like I put it on this tray. Just like what she's doing. And do a little swirl. looks pretty good. Let's make the next one a little bit bigger. All right. I'm not very good, but practice makes perfect. Okay, here we go. All right, throw it in my hand again. Boop! <laughs> Ooh. All right, here we go. Whoa, that one has a lot of chocolate. Here we go. Oh, go watch her again. All right, I'll make one last one. There we go. Swirl it around. Put it right there. 
let's squeeze some chocolate on top. Whoa! <laughs> that looks like a tasty truffle. All right, now that I'm all done, let's go wash my hands again. Let's go over here. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> all right, like I said, I'm all done. And those chocolates are gonna be so tasty. You know what other chocolate might be tasty? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna lick the chocolate off my hands because I'm all done with the production of the truffles. And then I'll wash my hands immediately after. <laughs> that was super tasty. <laughs> Ooh, thank you. Have a great day. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yum, I am so excited to eat this. Doesn't it look tasty? Whoa, wasn't that fun learning about all those tasty treats? <laughs> like this, this chocolate dipped ice cream cone. This is gonna be so good. <laughs> we saw the conveyor belt, we made some truffles. Oh, hey. <laughs> some friends! Whoa! Let's try some! How's the sweet treats, kids? Mmm! Mmm-hmm! Mmm! Real good! <laughs> well, that was so much fun learning what we learned today at Foam's Candy Shop! Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Good job. All right, see you soon. Bye-bye. Hey, look at where we're at. Today, we are at the Hands-On Children's Museum in Olympia, Washington. Come on. It's like we're on the farm. Ooh, we have some broccoli. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> it's so green. Ooh, ooh, and look, carrot. Um, bunnies love carrots. And this is the color orange. <laughs> Come on. Ooh, some onion and peas of corn. I love corn. <laughs> Corn on the cob, green and yellow. Whoa! Look, this is sidewalk chalk. Whoa! H I. This says hi. Hello. <laughs> oh, come on. Ooh. Wow. I'm about to make some bubbles. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Whoa. These bubbles are so big. Wow, whoa. Okay, I'm gonna get it really close to you. Whoa. Oh, look, there's a cute little bubble. <laughs> Come on. Look at all these sticks. This is called Raccoon Run. Come on! Whoa! Wow! This is some beautiful art just with, made with sticks. Whoa! Oh. We're kind of trapped in here. Come this way. Come through here. Whoa! What's this over here? This is where you get to ride the trikes. Okay, one trike, please. <laughs> you have to wear your helmet, and this helmet is the color black. Whoa. <gasps> Wee! Whoa! Look, this tricycle is called tricycle because it has three wheels and tires. Whoa. 
If it was a bicycle, it would have two. All right, here I go. We're coming up on a big hill. Here I come. I can't do it. Sometimes in life, if you can't do something, you have to try something new, like this. Let's walk it up. That's okay. This is still fun. <laughs> oh, whoa. Here's downhill. Here I go. Whoa. Whoa. Look, Ma. No hands. Whoa. 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 It's time to build a boat. This area is where you can build a boat. Like, take a piece of wood, like this one, and grab a straw, put it right there. Ooh, and we get to make a sail, like this green sail. Put it right there, do it around, and then let's add a pink top. Ready? Oh. Oh. oh, there we go. Look at that. What a beautiful boat. But wait a second. We need, we need a person inside. Do you want this one or this one? Ah, uh, let's do this one. Okay. How does that look? Whoa, it's so beautiful. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, and then let's take a giant squid. Okay, now let's come over here and put the boat in the giant squid right here. Whoa, look at this. This is the water table and it's really wet. Okay, before we put the boat and the squid in the water, let's go get our water jacket on. Come on. Okay, this water jacket is the color yellow. Oh. Oh. Ah. It's nice and snug. Oh. Okay, we're ready. Come on. Okay, let's put the boat. Oh, wait a second. Let's go back here. We have some plastic pieces, so then we can make an obstacle course. Ready? Okay, whoa. <laughs> okay, here we go. Put one right there. Put one right there. Put one right here. Oh, put one over here. Whoa, that's a big stretch. These are the color yellow, just like the jacket. Put one right there. Put one right here. Okay, wow. Now I think we're ready to put the boat and the giant squid in the water. Ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. Go, boat, go. Oh. Oh. Go, go. Yeah, we lost the squid. Oh no, don't get stuck. Come on, come on. It's coming. The squid is coming. Okay, here we go. Yeah, we're doing it. Woohoo! Boat made it to the end. Good job. Yum. I love the smell of plants and the texture. Jeez, it's just so beautiful. Whoa, what's this over here? Is this an area that we can go digging in? Come on. Whoa, a green bucket. Ooh, a miniature green dump truck. Whoa and a green excavator. Let's see what we can dig up. Whoa. Whoa, look! Wow, this is a triceratops. Whoa, really old dinosaur. Come on. Ooh. 
We saw a small green dump truck earlier, and now this is a big green dump truck. Vroom, vroom, vroom. This looks like the area where you get to load up the dump truck. Watch! Okay, load it up! Here we go! Whoa! 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 <laughs> oh, hello! <laughs> this looks like the perfect place to dump all of this rock. Ready? Beep, 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 beep. Rah, so heavy. Whoa. Wow. That was a big load in the back of the dump truck. Good job. Wow. Look at this room. It's like we're in a forest. There's so many trees in here. Ooh, look. Wow. Pretty plants. <laughs> Ooh, and look at this. This is like tree bark. Wow, come here. Look how big this tree is over here. Oh, look. Do you see an animal that flaps its wings anywhere? Go, 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 go. Look, it's up there. See? Look over here! Since we're in the forest, there's a tent. It's like we're going camping. Look! Ow! Hot! Hot! And then here's a wood, a piece of log. Okay, and then, whoa, the vacuum tube room. Come here. Wow, I love this room in here. Okay, see, you grab the colorful balls and their scarves, like the orange one, purple one, yellow one, and even the red one, and then, you put it in here. Whoa, whoa. And it goes over there. Watch, whoa, it goes to the top. I'll do some more, ready? Are you ready? a lot of these. We have to switch these up. Hey. Now you don't know where they're going to go. It's going to go a different path. Whoa! Wow. That was a really fun blue spinny slide. Ooh, come over here. Look at this area. Wow. This area looks like you can build with these tubes. Whoa. And there's smokestacks coming out of here. Whoa. Whoa. 
Whoa! Hello! Can you see me? Hello! <laughs> Don't worry, I'm right here! Hey! Whoa! Uh, uh, <laughs> okay! Wow! Oh! And look at this! Whoa! This has smoke beneath all this water! Can you see it? Wow! It's so fun to touch! It feels so good! Whoa! Wow! My hands are really wet! Okay! <laughs> Whoa! Look at this! Wow! It's a vortex! Kind of like a water volcano! The water just spins around really fast! Whoa! <laughs> okay! Here's some colorful balls and I'll put them up here. Ready? Okay, now that the tube is all lock and loaded with those balls, get ready. Bombs away! Three, two, one! Whoa! Okay, now look at the balls! Whoa! <laughs> wow! Did you see those? Wow! Okay, I'm gonna grab some more of these colorful balls, like this pink one, this yellow one, this purple one, and there should be some more coming. Oh, another pink one. Oh, another purple one. A white one. Okay, get ready, because I'm gonna launch them up there. Here we go! Whoa! Whoa! Look up there! Whoa! Do you see him in the vortex now? Wow! I'm launching the balls up there! And then they go down the vortex! Okay! Just a couple more. Here we go, balls. Wow. Whoa. That is so cool. Whoa. This water vortex is so much fun. Wow. Whoa. We're driving to the job site. Here we go. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> okay, now that we're at the job site, whoa, we need to grab our tools, like the shovel, and whoa, whoa, uh, uh, yeah, uh, look at that heavy brick, whoa, whoa, and this giant boulder, uh, 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 whoa, ha <laughs> ha. Okay, let's bring everything over here. Okay. Oh, okay, this is gonna be the job site. Let's go look over here though at all the tools. Like this jackhammer. Wow. And, oh, a hard hat. And a safety vest. Whoa, that's very small. Maybe. I won't wear a safety vest this time, but I will wear a pair of blue safety goggles. Ah! <laughs> Ooh, and look, a nail gun, a drill. Ooh, a mallet. Wow, a crowbar. Ooh, and a jigsaw and a tape measure. Whoa, okay, let's go. Oh, good thing I have my hard hat on. <laughs> okay, let's get some safety cones. Let people know we're gonna be building a house over here. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay, and here we go. Some oh. uh, road sign. Oh, here we go. Gotta put this over here. Okay. Now, all of our lumber is over here. Let's grab two of these. One, two. Let's put them down on the ground. 
and let's get two really long ones. And go like this. There we go. Oh, nope. Let's go like that. Okay. Oh, here we go. This is the foundation of our house that we're building. Okay. Ready? You stay there, and I'm just gonna start to build. one. Put it right there. Right there. Looks like we just built a beautiful house. Let's test it out. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> well, I guess it wasn't that strong. Whoa, whoa, two, two, <laughs> whoa, two, three, four. Whoa. whoa, look at where we are. We're inside an oyster. And look, it's a giant pearl. So white and shiny and beautiful. And these? Yeah. These represent a grain of sand. Whoa. Because if a grain of sand gets inside an oyster, then from there it gets really irritated and then it creates a pearl. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> well, this was so much fun hanging out with you at this children's museum in Olympia, Washington. It was so much fun being so hands-on. Well, see you again. Bye-bye. Come on, everyone. Let's make a learning fun. Mika, Mika. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Mika.